Well, folks, welcome back to the Turning Stone Classic 31. We're coming to you live from the Turning Stone Casino and Resort in Verona, New York, with our final match of Friday. It's going to be Jennifer Beretta versus Laurie John Hansen. You can see Laurie John right there on your screen. It's a race to nine on the B side. One of these ladies will be eliminated. Which one will it be? You vote. I'm taking Lori John over Beretta, says Bobby Hooker. Uh, before we get started and underway, hey, we want to make sure that we uh, thank a lot of the sponsors. Lights out. Billiardsapparel.com. Mr. Zuad, uh, Zuad, Zuad. I'm trying to pronounce his name the right way. He's a real estate broker up in the greater Boston area. Uh, he's investing online. He's uh, got a lot of openings. If you're interested in making some serious cash, get right over to that website and check him out. Josh Q's, big sponsor with Mike Zuglin for many years. Kamui, KamuiTips.com. There's your Lights Out logo right there. And you're talking about Lights Out. You get 15% off. Just mentioned Turning Stone 15. And free shipping within the continental USA. The JB cases, we got to go through these. We'll be in, uh, we got the hand signal. Let's go, let's go. Thomas Grimaldi and family. Uh, I've been telling you about them. They build custom game rooms in your household, or if you're open a commercial business, they do it. All the T's crossed and the I's dotted. Check them out, tgrimaldibilliards.com. In view, billiardproductreviews.com. It's a nonprofit organization. They buy the items, they put them through rigorous tests, and they give you a honest and unbiased reviews all on their website. Very interesting website. They came on board with us a couple of years ago. And they're still on board. Thank you, Steve. Light hyphen systems. This is the LED lighting that's being installed in several pool rooms within your area. Uh, the reason being, it's cheaper to run. It gives off 10 times the lighting, no shadowing, and it's 10 times lighter to hang. It opens up your pool room. It's sort of like knocking down a major wall in your household and getting the dining room, the kitchen, and the living room all in one. What an island. I mean, it's just unbelievable lighting. Go to light-systems.com. Mr. Greg Antonakis, uh, get your southwest from the best. Uh, Greg is one of the top guys when it comes to dealing with. You see nothing but positive uh, remarks on Facebook. Uh, quick delivery. The item is what the uh, gentleman said, and I follow all of that. And uh, I've been with Greg, and Greg's been with me for years. We've been friends. Uh, Check out Greg at GAA uh, on Facebook at Greg Antonakis or American Q Pickers. Uh, you can email him right there at that phone number, and he's got plenty of cues, whether it be jo uh, Southwest or anything as in Predator, too. He's got always custom cues to fit your budget. Gentleman Jim to deal with. We want to wish his wife, Mel, uh, happy birthday. Baltimore City Cues. They are here on premises. They're up at the front of the uh, arena. They have a, a booth set up there. Uh, make sure to come in and check them out. They sponsor a lot of players, and they got a lot of cues. They got a lot of gadgets, to the cases, you name it. They got it. Baltimore City Cues, the mobile store, anything from tips to tables. Thekingsofvapor.com for all your vaping needs. They are now across the eastern seaboard, all the way down to Florida from Ohio. Mr. Mike Burton, he's here on premises. He does have a booth, and he's got an array of cues 
Uh, make sure you bring a bib because you're going to be drooling anything from the oldest ones to the latest ones. And if he doesn't have the one you want, he's the man to go to, Mr. Mike Burton at MBQs.com. The best cloth in the world is Simonis. That's what we're playing on. And the best balls to roll with are Aramith, and that's what we're rolling with. I want to thank those two major companies uh, because without all these companies here on board, trust me when I tell you, we wouldn't be able to do it. I want to thank Rob Pohl. He's, <laughs> he's one of my main squeezes. He's off to the side. Uh, we're going to – come on. Uh, I'm trying to get Rob Pohl in the booth. The reason I'm trying to get Rob is Rob owns Skyline Billiards, and now Jennifer Britta and her husband Greg McAndrews took over Skyline Billiards, and Rob Pohl happens to be here. They're, they're great friends. They try to do everything together as far as uh, promoting pool in Brooklyn, New York. So I'm trying to get uh, Rob Pohl in the booth, but he says, I can't right now. <laughs> but uh, we're ready to roll. Uh, oh, you know what? Billiard... BilliardEngineering.com, my man Keith, uh, here's his commercial, and I apologize, Keith, because it totally elapsed in my half. Quick, slick shaft maintenance system. Billiard Engineering provides nine micron rated films of three different grits. They're specifically selected to progressively put that glassy smooth feel on the shaft and keep it there. We also provide a patented burnishing block to ensure the pressure of each film is evenly distributed around the entire shaft. The results are incredible. Quick slick shaft maintenance system at the following locations. Pool dog. And Make sure to check out uh, quick slick at billiardengineering.com. It's the latest tool for shaft maintenance. Uh, people have been buying it like mad. They've been buying two at a time at the shows. Uh, this guy, these guys have been on board, and it's a unique item. Uh, it's quick slick at billiardengineering.com.
Folks, we're going to have Sutton Death, Steve Sutton, sit in with uh, Mr. Ed Colhane. Yes, sir. He's asking to be in momentarily. We're going to let Mike Zuglin do his introductions. Then after he does the main table, we'll shut Mike off on our end and uh, proceed with the match. Jennifer Breda, Lori, John Hassan coming up. From Newark, Delaware, he's an eight-time Mez Tour Player of the Year. He's sponsored by Kamui, Hustling Clothing, and Predator, Matt Cry. And his opponent, <coughs> he's from Clifton Park. He's a, a good up-and-coming young player. This is his third appearance here at Turning Stone, Jordan Turner. Good luck. Okay, from Ochopee, Florida, regular on the Florida Tour. And when he's up here, he plays out of Salt City Billiards. In, in uh, Syracuse, welcome Jerome Rockwell and his opponent. He's a uh, BCA Hall of Famer, and he runs the International Nine Ball Open in Norfolk, Virginia. If you want more information about how to enter that or how to spectate, see Pat Fleming, BCA Hall of Famer, man. All right, table number four from Sparta, New Jersey, one of our uh, regular players on the tour. has a lot of high finishes in our tournaments, and he's a... Uh, Good, great player. Doesn't get out to play as much as he probably would like to. Jason Mikus. All right. And his opponent, he's from Astoria, New York, originally from Alaska, where he was a two-time state nine-ball champ. He's the multiple New York City Open champ as well. He's a house pro at Amsterdam Billiards, Sean Morgan. Okay. <clears throat> All right. We're down there to table five from Amherst View, Ontario, sponsored by ChalkBeGone.com. His... Uh, his business, and uh, I think they have some of your product up there at the uh, Baltimore City Q's booth. Check it out. Devin Buttle and his opponent. He's uh, he's uh, been the BCA chaplain since 2007. He's sponsored by McDermott Q's from Halladon, New Jersey, Steve Lillis. All right. Moving on down here, we have from Westfield, Massachusetts, a regular player here at Turning Stone, owns his own business. He only, how come you don't come play in our regular tournament? Too far. <laughs> Frank Gaetani. All right. His opponent, another young gentleman, just started to play with us the last couple of seasons. He plays out of Eagles Billiards, Eagle Billiards and Jack and Jill's Billiards down there in Mountaintop, around there, Scranton, wherever, down that way, somewhere in PA. Jim Kearney. All right. All right. We're down here on table number seven. From uh, Philadelphia. We welcome uh, our good friend and regular here at Turning Stone, great player, Rob Hart, and his opponent. He's another great player from Harv de Grace, Maryland. He's a multiple winner on our tour, as well as uh, Action Pool Tour Player of the Year, formerly. He's sponsored by Black Heart Tips, Raymond's Pro Shop, Brews and Cues, Lights Out Apparel, and that's it, isn't it? Did I miss somebody? Lucasi. All right, Sean Wilkie. All right. All right, look at this matchup down here. We're running the ladies' tour. All right, sit. 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 <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, remember, this one's live streamed. You can watch this on uh, 
uh, on the live stream, courtesy Upstate Owl. I guess you can access it through azbilliards.com. It is on Facebook, and we got a bunch of people over there. And the who do we got this time? Who we got? Oh no, not Eddie again. Cut Eddie's microphone off. <laughs> Steve Sutton, Upstate Owl. All right. All right, first from New York City, she's the owner of Skyline Billiards. She's a former Empress Cup champion, former Predator Pro-Am Player of the Year, Jennifer Beretta, right over there. And her opponent, she's from Piedmont. Piedmont, you moved. That girl. And this is her second appearance here at Turning Stone. She's on our poster if you'd like to grab one. She's an eight-time world champion, five-time Player of the Year, BCA Hall of Famer, and she's sponsored by United Billiard League and Joss Q's, Lori John Hassan. All right. Good luck. That promises to be a great match, people. All right, let's move over to the other side. We'll get going here on table number nine from Rochester, New York. Plays out of East Ridge Billiards, where we will have a stop in February. Mark Kramer and his opponent also... Like he I said, folks, we're cutting Mike room. Zuglin off in the booth. Ed Colhane and Steve Sutton. Take it away, guys. What's going on, everyone? Thank you, sir. This should be a great match. Yeah, that's a great lag by Lori John. Yeah, I mean, it froze it on the rail there. That was yep. a great, great lag. Well. So Lori John will break. Lori John uh, um, just lost to Annie. Congrats, Annie! If you Annie so Flores is playing great, yeah. Yeah, good for her, man. That was a great win for her. She's been playing great. I yeah, know. I saw her on yeah. Facebook. If you're watching Annie, you did real good. Yeah. And you have Rob Hart up there playing uh, Get Some. Sean Wilkie. Yep. Pat Fleming's up there as well. I was going to watch him, but I'll sit here in the booth. Let's check the break. Let's see where the three ball ends up. A little high and nine ball track into the side pocket. Dry break and, and yep. Lori John's going to be liking this with an open table. Oh, Beretta. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. Lori John dry break. So thank, Beretta. Thank you, thank you, sir. Just getting to the three balls. Uh, you need to get the angle to get down here for the three sorry. and she'll be good. She can, as long as she's in the straight, she can either follow this or draw this to just make sure she has an angle to get to the three ball. Right, right. I think she'd have to bounce. I would want to bounce up here. Yeah. I would definitely want to bounce do. up. I don't want to take the angle to, to slide down. Although she's using the bridge, so no one knows now what she's going to do. No, she'll probably follow this. Follow this, come off. She should. Or go, she, actually, she's looking to draw with the bridge. Oh, no, no. That's, I don't like it. She can still get on the three now. She could just draw back to the rail. Maybe end up about the first diamond. Yep. And she's still going to, but she's going to be long on the three ball. <laughs> Maybe she could stun it down a little bit here. Yeah, that's what she's going to try to do. Yep, yeah, but she did. Yeah, she's okay. She's going to take the long shot on the three ball. Uh, behind this table is Rob Hart, the brother of Kevin Hart, the comedian, and he's playing uh, Sean Wilkie in this table right behind the girls here. Wow, nice, shot. nice hit. Very nice shot. That's about perfect. She can draw this up and she'll have the five in the, side, in the corner. Yep. She's drawing, using the bridge again, but this is relatively easy. Yeah, it's gonna, she, she's going to draw it behind the six. Oh, boy. You know, that was just uh, a little bit of carelessness there. No way does she miss a ball like that. Right. It was almost straight in, for God's sakes. Yep. And Lori John's got to be happy about this. Didn't expect that to happen. She's got to draw this back, does she not? No, she might have to follow this two rails. She is. I thought drawing it might be the move. No, I like the fall there. I think she's the right shot. Remember, we will be there February 23rd and 24th. 
So she drove it to the long rail and bounced back. Yep, I agree. All right, his opponent from Westmoreland, New York, not too far from here. He's one of our regular players with a lot of high finishes. He plays at a Utica Billiards on the Boulevard. Will be there too, August sixth and seventh. Willie Oni. Nice shot. Very yeah, nice control. Good ball. Nice shot. Yeah, she's almost in stop, stop, stop position now. Pretty much. Yeah. She'll stop this. She'll stop this. She'll probably roll up for the eight. Stop on the eight. Yeah. Shoot the nine. Yep, just like that. It's a nice layout. But but for Jennifer to miss that bridge shot was it's going to haunt her a little bit. You know, she yep. needs to snap out of that. Yep. Shake that off right away. Uh oh. Just yep. Uh oh boy. Wow. She banked that. <laughs> she banked that off that long round. Did you see that, Steve? There it is. One nothing, uh, Lurie John. And uh, one nothing, Sean Wilkie. He's getting ready to break as well. All the scores are on azbillions.com, uh, updated every rack uh, by Steve, by Mike Howerton up in the stands here. Yeah. So you can just log into azbillions, you'll see every match going on and, and, and the status. Yeah, I mean. 16 tables going. So awesome that he does that. I mean, <laughs> you know, it's tough. I mean, you watch 16 matches and the guy watches all 16 tables and all the live long. score. That's great. All I mean, day long he sits up there. You got to give him credit for doing that. It's yeah. phenomenal. There's a good break, but it might be a dry break here. And I think it is. So Jennifer Bird will come to the table again. With a shot on the one. I guess thin this one on the on the left side and, and come back down by the two and send it over. Oh, she's going she's going uh, on the right side of it. She's going behind the wow. four six. I thought that was tough. Yeah, yeah that she's I a, think she can see a piece of the one. Yeah. I can't really tell, but I think she can see a piece of it. She's got an edge, maybe an edge to zigzag down. Uh, she could she could play a good safety here, you know, zigzagging down and maybe end up under the nine here. Yeah, that's what yeah, she that's did. Yeah, that's a great shot. Yeah, she actually had more than a piece of it for oh, the, in order to do that, and she played a great safety. Yeah, that was, unless she has that window right here. And who wouldn't love this window between the two nine? Look at it. Oh, boy. Merry Christmas. You know what? She may have to jump the edge of this, too. I think that's what she's going for a break cue. I think she's going to jump this. Oh, because she's... To get between. Just to jump the edge of the two. Maybe the slightest bit for the hit. The edge of the two and the edge of the nine, yeah. too, actually. Because she's... I mean, but yeah. Yeah. I think she's going to hit this. But there's no reward here. Unless, she, unless that six comes down and pockets that five ball. But that's a long shot. Yeah, I mean, she's just going for a hit here. Yeah. Happy to have this window, by the way, you know. Nice hit. Very nice. Well. Very nice hit. I mean, a, left long. you left her long. Yeah, left her long. Tough to get on the two ball. But so. Lori John played that safe so well, too. She didn't deserve to leave that window. Yeah, that's right, Mike. She had no window there, so she had to jump over a piece of each ball and with the jump cue. Oh, you're reading. I, I'm reading. I thought you were answering me, calling me Mike. No, no, read, reading some of the uh, chat. Uh, I, I can't see it. Answering the, answer the, the chat while the match is going on. Thanks, guys, for tuning in and supporting this. Oh, look, she went for and the that's bank. A great. Oh, she, oh, oh, she oh did that it. cost her? I don't really know if she was going for that bank. No, I think she, she was, was playing, playing safe, safe and, and she, it just went. And she nailed it. Look what happened. And unfortunately, that does happen where, you know, you play a. You feel like you play a great safe, and then the ball goes, and then now you're stuck with it. <laughs> and I think she's frozen to the back of that four ball, so it's going to make it very tough to hit. Tough hit right here, and, and you know, as tough as it is, 
if you could lay that four ball down on top next to this three ball, you could mess things up. But uh, it's it's just too close to the work that's probably frozen. Yeah, she's frozen to the four. Yeah, I think she's frozen to the back of it. Oh, she's going to try and go this way behind the, behind the around six. the six. Wow. it's I don't care what she's doing. It's tough. She can't tie anything up here, so that's off the table. She's looking for the zigzag. She's looking for the, for the Z shot. Oh, she may have one here. Look at that. Look at that. She may have it. One, two. Oh, oh no. She caught uh, that. Yeah. She caught the uh, eight ball. Well. And I'll tell you right now, nope. that two nine, she might take it, but it's kind of an open table. Yeah. She, Yeah, no, she's not. I personally don't like combinations anyway. The three but five is doable though. The three five, I guess she's gonna play it. Yeah, that's fine. I'm saying like any combos like on the nine. Right. right I right. typically don't like chasing the nine if I can get out on an easy rack because yeah, sure. the problem is, is when you do that, um, you know, say for example, you go for a two nine or a three nine, and you miss it and sell out the rack. Now you're thinking, crap, I had a whole rack. Wide open rack. Why didn't I just play the out? And it could cost you two games. Yeah, because yeah. then your opponent breaks and sure. break and run. And sure. Yeah, so yeah. usually it does cost you two games. Uh, yeah. look, well, look at Sean Wilkie earlier. He missed an eight ball at two two, and in the next fifteen minutes it was six two. It cost him four games that that one shot against Dennis Grobby. You know, Dennis plays real well. And he ran a four pack. Well, not a four pack, but it was lickety split. He was <coughs> a, yep. a big change. I don't know if he did run a four pack, but he he did have a package there somewhere. Uh, and and Sean, that April had to be eaten at him. Just the same thing happened here. You know, it's just she uh, she pocketed that bank shot by accident. And right. Nice shot. Very nice. nice. Shot. Uh oh, locked up to six. Nope. No, she can still see it. She yeah. can push. She can pocket yeah, it. She's got it. But then the seven's a little question. She's got to go back and forth. Yeah, that's what she'll do. Right. It's just a little firm. You're naturally going to come back back over. Yep. Back and forth. Maybe a hair of outside so you don't bump into the seven ball. Just come cross table. Yeah. Two rails. I think she'll miss it even with it without the outside. <laughs> oh. Yeah, see, that's well, why. Or you, or you could do that. <laughs> right. I, I had a feeling she was going to bump into it. Oh, really? Uh, it worked out for her because yeah. it went down to the corner. No so. one, yeah, but no one was expecting that one. That was a good shot. Good call. Well, very nice. And she gets to tie it up with this win here. Yep. Yep. So you might see a real battle here, back and forth. No, this is a coin flip. There you go. Jennifer Broda ties the score. One apiece and breaking. Again, thanks guys for tuning in to watch this good, ma great match between Jennifer Breda and J Lori John Hassan. Day two. Yep. One apiece and Beretta to break. Troy, what's going on, Troy? Hey, Troy. I thought you were making taking the ride. Yeah, are you coming down here, Troy? I didn't know if you were or not. Get in the truck. Huh. Jen's going to look over the rack real quick. Yeah. So, Jen to break.
and she's breaking from the left side. So watch the four ball. Four ball is your wing ball. And the one in the side. Four went oh, right in yeah. the corner. And she's on the one. Notice a lot of players doing that. They'll play the wing ball and actually they'll make the one in the side also. They're doing that. Johnny was doing it yep. consistently before. Yep. She's going to get on this two ball real well. And if she can get straight, she'll be stop, stop, stop. This is key right here to get straight on this two. Yep. It's not going to kill her if she doesn't. She could always slide over and play the three in the same corner. Uh, but it would be ideal if she can get perfectly straight here. That's pretty good. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Yeah, she'll hold it for the three now, and then she's in stop-stop mode. Everything's laying real, real good. Don't roll forward here and get on the roof with that eight ball. Yeah, no, just the Oh, she do elect, elect to go to that side. Yep. Good move. Playing that three in the same pocket. Yeah, she could one rail this maybe. Yeah, one rail go down and bounce up. Oh, yeah, maybe give it a little bit more. Maybe you come out two rails maybe and punch it a little bit. No, no, she can go one rail on here. One rail hair up inside. Straight up and down, yeah. Oh, or no, she or two, two rails. She could have gone yeah. either way. So now, yeah, she's now she's on the wrong side. She needed to get up more because now the six ball, uh, I don't imagine she's she's got to hold this or she does have that window between the seven and eight to come around. I think she'll let the stroke out. I think she'll just play She's the five with the inside. Take the and angle. And then play the six in the same pocket. Right. Just like that. There you go. Nice shot. Yep. This is from the break. Right? This is from the break. Yeah. shot. Jennifer owns Skyline Billiards in uh, Brooklyn with um, her husband, Greg. Greg. Uh, Greg's probably up in the stands. There he is. I think that's him up in the top. Yeah, row. that is him. You think so? No, yeah. No, it definitely is. With the glasses, that's definitely him. And she just hung up the seven ball. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Don't so get old, kid. Don't get old. <laughs> uh oh, side pocket. No, she's fine here. Yeah, yeah. I would do some inside English, two wheels inside English, and bounce straight back up. Oh, she went outside. Look at that. Yeah, I thought she would do that. Yeah. Yeah. Nice shot. It's more of a natural. It was, yeah. The inside was, was kind of tempting, though. You yeah, know? Uh, it was more of a natural route, yeah. so. And she takes the lead here, two to one with this nine ball. Oh, my God. Wish that she wishes she had that do over. Uncharacteristic miss yeah. from Lori yeah. John. And Lori John's got too many titles under her belt to be missing that ball, you know. Happens to everyone, folks. It does. Nice shot. Jennifer Breda goes up, score two to one. You'll never miss a ball from the chair here. No, well, I've got no reason to say anything because I missed my share of shots today so <laughs> I had a good time it, here. it was fun it was a fun time oh, it was fun I mean I had yeah. great my first day and then I just today I just struggled so I'll be back I mean there's gonna there's a second chance tournament you got years to go <laughs> then I'm gonna try to get to no I know I you just, know you, you do know. yeah yeah you know you got you got years to go looking at well you're young what do you, how old are you 
I am 34. I'll be 35 in February. Well, I got socks older than you, but no, really. I mean, you got Billy Thorpe. Uh, he's got years to go. How young is he? Look at Kachi. Oh, boy. Well, yeah, he's, oh, yeah. My, what, under 21, right? And it's yeah. just, and you're going to see these guys for the next 20, 30 years. Jason? Billy actually just lost to uh, Petri. Did, did he? he lost to who? Billy was up 4 uh, nothing on Petri Mackinnon. Oh, okay. And uh, Petri got him. Wow. Yeah, Billy's a monster. Yeah, he is. He won this last year. Yeah, and uh, so Jen to break the seven ball. Watch the seven. Is your wing ball? Went a little high, and I believe she came oh. dry. Wow! Didn't leave a window. Oh, there might be a window here. Yep, there's a window between the two and the eight. There's no push here. No pushing this and you can push after the break, folks. But I think she's got the window between the two and the eight. But uh frozen on the rail, you can't do too much here. Yeah. She's gonna have to take a I don't think you can pocket speed it for the oh she's trying she's, to I think she's, she's trying to saying this. She's trying to draw it a little bit, isn't she? Oh. I think she could see the one, but she could see the one, but she couldn't see enough to she pocket it. She couldn't see it. all of it, yeah. So she went to try to mass it. That might be costly. This is a decision here. She's got to go down and bounce up, doesn't she? Yeah. She could hold here, but I don't think she. I don't think she will. I think she'll come back. Yeah, I think she has to. Yeah. Up and down. To play it right. Yeah. It, was, it was tough, and she got the best of it too. Yep. Yeah, she got behind the five three. <clears throat> well, run one wheel kick over here, but. Wow. Well, this is kind of tough here. She's got to spin it a little here, doesn't she? Yeah. Yeah, a little left hand English to make up for that side pocket. Okay. Right, she got a good hit. Where is she going to leave it? No, oh, she'll leave her a shot. Jennifer's going to be happy with this. Look at the two, three, and every, the way everything's laying. Yeah. Just needs to get straight on the three ball, and uh, she can draw it over for the four. She hit that pretty good. Yeah. Overshot a little, but she's still going to get on the three. Yeah, she'll play it in the corner. She'll just probably draw back. Yeah, I thought she might go forward on this too. Yeah. Oh she, no, she might. Yeah, yeah she's going go forward. forward. She wants to get straight on this three if she can. Yep. You're going to need more speed than that. Yeah, she she doesn't have the top corner here, and she's got to come down and, and stun this a little bit and bounce off the low off the short rail, yep. off the bottom rail here, and, and bounce up for the four, I think. Yeah, yeah, she will. She definitely has to, yeah. Just don't scratch on that side. Don't get a well, straight wood match. She can play the five in the side if she had to, I think. Oh, no. She yeah, don't have to do it anymore. I was afraid the five was going to get in the way there, oh, and... Boy. Well, well, you would love to kick at this ball and make it here. You know, is there a kick to the to to the top rail? There is a kick, isn't there? You could kick this two rail, go rail rail up to that long rail. Yep. And, and yeah, yeah. You know, but it, she might have no choice but to play it that way, whether she likes it or not. Well, she could go to this long rail and one rail it here. She could. Yeah, and maybe that might be the safest bet than than going for the win here. Well, the problem is she has to hit this ball. If she doesn't hit the ball, if she doesn't hit this ball, then Lori John has a four nine right. Well, well, wired she, combo. She needs to definitely run into the pack either side. It doesn't matter. Just disturb it somehow. I mean, you can also intentionally foul and move the combination, but at the same time, you're playing Lori John, and she'll probably run out. So it's yeah, you could uh, kind of tough either way. If you if you no. Yeah. Be kind of tough to budge the nine a little bit and mess mess up the uh, the line that she's going to well, one rail it. She's going to she, one rail yep. it. Well, she's either going to hit it or she's going to break up the combo. 
Great hit. Wow, that was pretty nice. Wow, world class shot right there. Yeah, it was that good. really was. No, that was great. That was one of the better safeties of the day. I mean, really, she was stuck there, you know. And the speed and everything was perfect. Yeah, it was great. Uh, I'm wondering how easy this safety is. Uh, no, it's not that easy. It's not I, easy. She's I, I, jacked up over the nine. and I was thinking if she could go off the, the left side, and no, she doesn't have that. No, she said to be careful not to move this nine ball. I'm trying to put this up between the... Oh. No, 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 no. Uh, that's yeah. no good. No, because she's got a window between... She's yeah. got a window behind the seven to pocket the four. She had to be careful, though, because we are playing all ball foul. So if she was happy, if she happened to move that no, nine no. ball in the final, oh. if she happened and to move the nine ball in the final stroke, right, right, it's right. ball in hand. Yeah, if the cue ball's moving and you touch another ball, it's a foul. Yes, correct. I'm thinking it should be all ball foul, whether the cue ball's moving or not, would make it real simple. Yep. Well, she doesn't have to worry about the side pocket here. Oh, she came off that eight real nice, huh? Yeah, that worked out nicely. Yeah, I wonder if that was planned. It was a good move if it was. Yep. And I never, and I, and it's something you never see, so it never dawned on me to look for it. It's a good stroke by Jen. Yeah, and she's getting ready to go up three to one here. Oh, she can stop right here. Draw it back a little bit and play the eight in the side. Yep. Yeah, six side, seven corner, eight side, yeah, nine. Yeah, it's laying perfect. Corner, yep. Just like that. Yep. She might want to roll up here. Oh, she's straight? Yeah, she's going to roll up two yep. rails here. She'll get good. Nice angle here. Oh, she's bounced out. Yeah, she's fine. She's straight in. Yeah. She'll just see there. Just stop shot. Mm -hmm. Maybe draw back a hair so she's not so much angle on the nine ball, but she'll be okay. Unless she can roll forward and go back and forth, you know? I don't think she's going to. Nope. Yeah, just a stop shot. Stop shot, play the nine. You get a three to one lead with this, with this nine ball right here. Race to nine. Jennifer. Jennifer goes up one more. Score three to one. Watching Sean's game before Sean Wilkins' game with Dennis. Uh, I did see part of that when it was on the stream. Um, yeah, it was crazy. The Sean had a good week. He played uh, Shane in that uh, challenge match over at Salt City. Yep, and he won that. Yeah, Hill that was Hill. a big win. And he was up eight three at one time. How do you like that? Going to eleven, you're up eight three against Shane. But I believe uh, he lost to Dennis Hill Hill. Correct? Yeah, yeah, he did. Here, yeah, yeah, it was a battle. Hard fought, hard fought. But he came back from a 6-2 deficit. Yeah, I saw the last rack. I saw yeah, it kind of got yeah. into a little bit of a safety battle. See Jenna Brick, watch the six ball right in the corner pocket. Yeah. And a shot on the one. Yep. Shot on the one, two ball out in the open. Yeah, four right on the two in the corner with speed here, you know. Probably perfect. Unless you want to overhead yeah, a little. I think you can get straight on that two in the corner after this one here. 
Yeah, that's what she likes to do. She's got quite a bit of angle. Yeah. She's probably looking to see where she want, where she's going to hit the two ball, pretty yeah, much right where she was just standing. Now she's looking to go with the right hand corner. She hit a little firmer, you know. Hit yeah. Just one a little firmer and come. I would. Yeah. I don't think you can. Instead of floating it over, you know. Right. I wouldn't. Have, I wouldn't try to hold that for the left pocket. I would play it in the top right. Just watch out for the side pocket. Yeah. Perfect. Oh no no. Oh. Uh, she's on. The, Going to be elevated, and the three is locked up now. So now it's a different ball game. Yeah. Now we're going to get a little bit of a chess match going on. I don't think uh, she would like to play the safety on the three and roll up on the eight. So stay up above it. But look, the way this two balls laying, this is nothing but work here. Oh, safety she's play. She's ducking from the beginning. Safety play. Probably a smart mm. move. I mean, the two wasn't an easy shot to begin with, and there's no, no reward. Right. So let her make the mistake here, I guess. Pretty good safe. I mean, it was a contending safety. I mean, she can see the ball, so Lori John can probably put her with the speed maybe behind the four, or she might try to come around with a cue ball. Wow, sent the two down. Mm -hmm. and, uh, she's got the whole ball, I think. I think, yeah, she's got the whole ball. And also, with a little inside and a thin cut here, she can break out that three right here. Yep. Yeah, she's going to have to do a little bit of inside here, though. And, and the thin cut. Don't overhit this. Or you're going to... And then if she just gets up, she can play that safety on the three also. So what she needs to do is get to middle table if she wants, but that's tough with the five laying there. Oh. She came that way. Yeah. Does she take the bank? There's no reward for the bank because the four is up table. Right. So. I think she may duck behind the eight ball here. She could send the three down well, she could cheat over to towards the too. nine. And, yeah. And yeah, yeah. Zigzag it up, up table. Yeah, she did. Yeah. She needs this four ball right now. Left to hit. Uh, That's okay, though. Tough, you know. Well, Lori John has options here to play a safe. I mean, she can. The safe that I like here is to bank the three ball up table, but the cue will behind the eight. Yeah, that would be kind of logical. Just don't double hit. No, I mean, she's... You don't double hit it. Yeah. No, I mean, there's plenty of... Oh. She's actually going... She's going? No, she's not buying that. No, I can't tell if she's doing that shot or not. She's going to hit the right side of this, I think. Oh, oh she did... She's yeah. doing pretty wow. much exactly what I... Yeah, uh, over hit a little bit, but... What I called, but yeah, just... Yeah. Not hard enough because you the cue ball. You need the speed to put it on that top rail. And well, I mean, you, you could have gone either way. I mean, you could have a little bit easier. You're behind the five. A little well, harder. You're behind the eight. So I she mean, might have to run into the four here. Or it's probably gonna hit the four anyway, even if off the top rail, from behind. No, oh, wow. she went, went around it. What a great shot. She put it all together. That was a good shot. She's right in line to get on the five here. One rail down. And with this, she's yeah. get, she's going to get out in front four to one here with this win right here. And she's now she's in perfect shape right there. Yeah, she just wants to be. She wants to see where she wants to be on the seven to get to the eight. Yeah, she wants to roll down about one more ball, and she'll be perfect. <laughs> Oh, she's going to stop it right there? Yeah. Oh, she's going to fall on it anyway, good. Yeah. Oh, no, she drew yeah, it back she, more she's than okay. I thought. Yeah. She'll play this. She'll come. Oh, she can go forward. Two, two rails, rails yep. yeah. Inside, two rails. Yeah. Cue ball pretty much heading toward her to shoot the eight ball. Yeah. 
eight ball on the corner and then just come off two rails. Don't try to hold this. Just pocket the ball. Yeah, Cue ball sure. naturally comes over two rails for the nine ball on the bottom right pocket. Nice hit, Just nice like hit. That. And here it comes, four to one, Jennifer. I see Sean Wilkie breaking above us here. I don't yeah. know what the scores are, folks, but you can look at them on AZ Billiards. And I believe Sean may, may have five. You can't see anyway. I can see the beads. I can see the big black bead up there, so yeah. So, Jen wins another rack. Score four to one in favor of Jennifer Moretta. And Wilkie scratched on his break. We did. Get some, got none on that one. I'm supposed to be up there cheering on my road partner. Pat Fleming's playing up there somewhere up on table two or three. Who's he playing, Matt Carraw? No, no. I, What's that, because Matt Carraw's on table two. No, he's, no, it's not Matt Carraw. It's Dennis playing on three. Uh, I don't see him. I don't know. This guy here with the blue shirt. Yeah, I'm looking at... He's a, he's a local guy from up here, I, I think. I, I saw him at Salt City the other day. I think he hangs out there. I don't know his name. I'm sorry, mister. Oh, I don't even see Pat. He's Pat's in his down. chair. He's in his chair, I think. You got Mr. Alaska, Sean Morgan in front of him, and then you've got Jim Kearney in front of him, and then you got Sean Wilkie and Rob Hart. Yes, yeah, somebody in, in the, every, uh, half the field here is uh, 16 people here are going home after this. Yep. Start the car. Let's check the break here, Jennifer's break. Watch the four ball. The four ball is your wing ball. She's been hitting that good. Yeah, well, yeah, we got to watch the, the four on the side and the side and the one, or sorry, the four in the corner and the one ball probably toward the side. And, yep, she made the wing ball and eight ball. And, and unfortunately, yep. nothing on the one. Hmm. Bit of a tough push here. So, yeah, it is. Yeah, this is kind of tough. What are you doing? You're sending down to the six? No. No, you don't want to leave that yeah. cut. Past the six, you're going to have to go. Over to that first diamond where she is. Where yeah, stick she's is looking, right there. Yeah, she's looking down by that pocket. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, she said push, so... Parallel this one right back down, but you got the nine hanging over there, and uh, you don't want to be leaving a billiard, a camera with the one the one nine down here. So maybe she won't send the one down here, hoping to hide behind that two and three. Happens quite a bit, that double kiss. And you always kick yourself because you know it was easily avoided, you know? You just needed to look at it better. You don't have the side pocket for this two ball. So she's going to have to play it down in the corner for this. Wow. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't think she likes this combination here, but. Uh, no, she's eyeing in the corner. That's a big pocket down there as well, with that nine sitting there, I mean. Yeah, she's eyeing the two ball in the corner. Yeah, she should be. And she'll bounce over uh, one rail for the three on the side. Yep.
Well, it wasn't that big, was it? No, it was and not. And she tied up the 6 9. Well, kind of. I mean, I think the 6 ball still plays in either pocket. I think it does so, too. And with the 5 ball down there, it kind of makes it even, actually, kind of easy because you get the 2, the 3, the 5, and well, the 6 are right there. So seven, there to, yeah. so 7 to the 9, right? Yeah, that would be the only problem. Here, too, she needs to, she's drawn up for the side pocket here, maybe. Yes, yeah, she did. Good stroke. That's it. Yeah. Well, she's going to three rails here as well, isn't she? Yeah, she needs to come around here, doesn't she? I yeah. think so. Looks like it. She needs to get straight on this five. Yeah, she came around. And Watch that seven. <laughs> Hit it twice, but she's still good. <laughs> yeah, she got good, yeah. She can just... Move to seven that a little down. bit to help her along too. That seven moving down yeah. gives her an, a side pocket option now. So she'll just play this five ball. She'll either stop it or she'll roll down maybe a hair. Yeah. yeah. You know, she really. She rolled down a little bit. She, and well. She, wow. You know what? She really needed to. Because a big difference with five to one and four to two. This is uh, oh, absolutely. This is a big gap right here. Needs a bridge. She's either gonna. I think she has an extension too. I think oh, she maybe. maybe. Yeah, maybe. Wow, that was a tough miss right there. Yeah. That was probably careless is more than anything. Uh, they don't normally miss those shots. No. And yeah, there's that extension that she has. She'll make sure pocket this five, and then she'll draw off the long rail to give herself, to give herself angle on the six to play the, to get to the seven, just like that. Even if she's straight, she's okay because she can. Yeah, she's good. She can do whatever she wants. Draw. Here. You just yeah. don't want to bump the nine. You, ideally, when you play nine ball, you don't want to bump into balls. I think she's going to draw this up for the seven in the side. You know. Yeah, she's got a possible shot. Hey, Ed, yeah. what's yeah. what's red and bad for your teeth? A We're brick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. I just, I just had to jump in there. <laughs> nice hit. Nice That's hit. That's my man Joe Very Collins nice. hitting me with that. <laughs> Don't quit your day job. Oh, Jesus, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> What's red and bad for your teeth? A brick. Hey, uh, yeah. Jennifer is starting to really uh, climb the ladder here, huh? Yeah, yeah she yeah, is. Yeah. I appreciate you guys sitting in. I'll tell you, give me a little bit of a break. I've been in the box since about 10 o'clock this morning. <laughs> so have I. Just calm down, Sparky. You have too, yeah. 13 yeah. hours, yeah. 13 hours. Long time sitting in the tank here. Yeah, it's good, though. It's comfortable. Mr. Tony Robles, what's going on, sir? Tony. Hey, Tony. What do you got happening, T? She's hanging out with Edward, though. Yeah, Jennifer's capitalized on a couple uncharacteristic mistakes. Lori John's been. Now, I thought she should have drew that ball. You know, and hit the top rail and bounce down. Yeah, I mean, she could She went inside on that one. Yep. She's good here. And uh, going to take a, a, a four-game lead on this nine ball, and that's pretty big. Just don't get comfortable because it could turn around in a New York minute. Nice hit. There you go. Very nice shot. She stayed down on that shot real good, too. Jennifer Bredog goes up another score, up another bead. Five to one in favor of Jennifer Beretta. You missed out before. Steve, you missed out. What did I miss out on? Al went to get candy, and Yednak ate it all up. Although I did get the uh, an almond joy, and uh, he shared half of. He's, he was he he scoffed it all up, is what he did. Well, I'll tell you right now, I have to I have to thank Al because we were talking about chili yesterday, and I did get some chili. It's actually really good. I did get some because I know they ran out yesterday, and I got some today. It's actually really good chili. I've had it, yeah. Well, it's pretty I've good. had it today and yesterday already, yeah. Yeah, I know. And, and it's, a, it's a home run. It's, it's a lousy $4 in a big container. This is a B-side match. Yeah. So one of these young ladies will be eliminated. 
Uh, and I don't believe they can play in a second chance tournament because of their skill level. Uh, Mike Zuglin holds a second chance tournament on the left side of the room, looking at your monitor this way here. He may let them in. He has let women pros in the second chance before. Oh, really? Uh, hmm. uh, Brittany Bryant was in one year. Oh, interesting. And uh, he wouldn't let Dave Fernandez in, but he let Brittany in. I said, Jennifer switched sides here already. Just uh, now she's looking to make this wing. Better. Why would yeah. she change a thing? Why would you? I mean, she was, oh, um, well. Sorry to cut you short. There's a back kick on this one. No, I mean, I kind of agree. I mean, her break has been working. She's been pocketing that corner ball from the other side, and I don't know what I mean. I'm in awe. Why would you change now? Well, you know, she must have seen something when it was racked. I mean, I guess. Oh, I don't know. Maybe, yeah, maybe you're, maybe you're right. You're right. Yeah, it's all about, you know, <clears> how. She did take right. uh, some lessons in that stuff, and, and it really paid off for her, she said. She does know how to read a rack. Nice kick. Oh, nice kick. Well, if she can get to this bottom rail and spin it, yeah, she can back kick this ball. Right, go right past the one yeah. with some with some inside English. What are you looking at there? Don't even what? She's looking at. She's looking at. She's looking at back kick it under the two. From two rails? Looks like it. Looks What's I, I'm think, I was thinking go, well. She is. She's going two rails, I think. Couldn't she come right here with some inside? Down to this. I mean. This is going to be a hell could, of a hit. This will be a hell of a hit if she gets it. Jennifer yeah, Barretta. What a shot. Very nice. Very nice hit. Now. Is there a combination with the two and also the one billiarding into the side? See the one off the two in the side and the two in the corner? Yeah. I think she might. She's looking at the one on the side right now. Um. It's almost lined up where she could almost make both of them here. I'm not. I'm serious, you know. Which is no, for, she's, she's playing the one on the side. She's playing the one on the side and then... Without the billiard. Right, yeah. No billiard. Oh, she played a safety. She played safe. She didn't get it. But she left the shot. Oh, boy. This is a tough position for the two ball as well. You know what she has to do is draw over to the, to the nine here and stop on the nine. Yep. What are you doing? Why is she kicking? She doesn't see it. What, what happened here? She's hunting after the nine, maybe. No. She snoozed it. She snoozed the hit. I don't know why she snoozed uh, the hit. Jen didn't go straight after that one she ball. Yeah, just, I don't. She, she had to snooze it. There's no way. That she had to snooze it. Maybe she liked the. Uh, I, I'd never seen her do that. No. no. She probably did. If she sees the tape, she's going to be upset. She, she probably did <laughs> snooze it. Yeah. She did snooze it. Hmm. I don't know if Greg's up there. Greg, her husband, is up there looking. He, I don't think he knows what happened yeah. either. It was really unusual to see, though. Yeah. Kind of rushing things, maybe, and just well, take a it time is with late it. at night. You yeah, know, sure uh, it is. These uh, players have been up uh, since early this morning. Well, yeah, long day. Yeah. So you know, fatigue sets in. Your your brain knows what you want to do, and your body and your body doesn't react. Well, yeah. I believe Jen's first match was 10 a.m. So it was yeah. very surprising to watch that. You know, it was oh, she had a 10 a.m. She did. Oh boy. I had dealers pay me when I didn't when I busted and I didn't have any cards in front of me late at night. You yeah. Know? Things happen. Yeah, yeah. That's true. Absolutely right. Uh, what she has? Side pocket or safety? What is this? She doesn't have the side, does she? And why? She, and, uh, she may have the I side, but there's no reward there. I can't, I can't tell if she's ducking. She's cutting this in the no. corner. She, it looks like. All playing safe. Bumping it into the six and letting the cue ball run. Overcut yeah, it. She was. <laughs> overcut it. Yeah, she was going for the shot. Oh, Jen's going to be liking this. Now, the eight's a little funny, but if you do play the eight, oh, no, the eight's good with the seven laying there. Because uh, when you do play the eight, you try and bump that nine up. Yep. So I don't know if Mr. Robles is still watching, but I appreciate your support, sir, and your comments. I see him, and hopefully I catch you around the... Uh, is he talking about me? When the No, when the uh, Predator Tour comes to uh, Snooker's. That's usually when I see him, so. He's a good man, Tony. He's a great guy. Yeah, yeah. And like I said, I, I must, mean. I must know him close to, 
I'm going to guess 40, over 40 years. Him yeah. and Gail are two stand-up people, and yeah. I look forward to seeing him. So. Thank you, Rob. Yes, they are uh, super <coughs> cams. Nice shot. Going back watch and forth. That, watch that roof. Watch the roof. There's yeah. the roof. But uh, she's okay because the six is laying good. Even to follow, even to go forward if she had to play play on the short side. Uh, she's actually not really on the roof here. No, no, she doesn't have to play the short side either. No, she'll just draw yeah. this. Yep, nice shot. Now she needs to probably get straight on the seven if she can. Well, she can either get straight on the seven in the corner or in the side. As long as she's right where her Q-tip is, as long as she's right there for the eight, she'll be okay because she wants to do is she'll pop the seven, roll the eight down to that bottom right corner to shoot the nine up. Right, and unless she has, to, unless she doesn't get that straight on the eight. If she doesn't get real straight on the eight, she'll have to bump the nine up a little, you know, draw into it. Right. Oh, and she got real good here. Yep. She got perfect. Nice she shot. Can just nice shot. Shoot the seven and roll. Yeah. Right up. Pretty much as close as she wants, as straight as she wants in that eight. Just as long as you're not behind the nine ball, you're right. okay. Right. And now, see, now she has to bump this nine up. And uh, I think she wanted a little bit further than that too. Even, even another ball forward. I don't. I think she is. I think she's just going to put a cut. I think she's just going to cut this eight in and then and go back come and back forth. And you forth think, I you think. think so? Yep. Well, well let's switch. She got the worst. Of, she hit the point. Dead, 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 and dead, and dead, dead end. How's that? I don't know. Does she have a bank here? She's going to cross it? That other angle showed a little bit better. She may have a bank. Yeah, she's looking at banking this cross side. Whoa. And that, it was so close to that rail, it just double kissed. It did double kiss a little, yeah. Well, leaves so Lori John a cut. Yep. Lori John's happy to have it, too, at 5-1. to one. She doesn't have to be back at the table right now. Right. With the way that cue ball deadened up on that point, she she's supposed to be she hit it firm enough to get back there. Yep. You know, I was gonna. Oh boy. You know, she's been been missing a few of them. She banked you know? that one in. Yeah. She's, but she's been missing a few. Closing the gap. Wiped its feet. But decided to become a visitor. Well, yeah, but look at six to five one. Five to two. Or six to one. So that was big. You well, know? Absolutely. Six to one just sounds a lot scarier, too. Man. I took that line from uh, Sid Waddell. I don't know if you know who that is. He did the commentary for the Moscone Cup. Mm, yeah. I watched a lot of the Moscone Cup, and he was one of the guys that uh, Sid Waddell actually passed away, I think, a year or a couple of years ago or whatever. Re uh, extremely funny commentator. I didn't watch too much of that. I couldn't hear co any any commentary. Yeah. I was on the road. I was in Florida, driving around the country. So much. Lori John's break, as we see behind us, Sean Wilkie scratched on his break. And she come and up dry. And she, oh, I thought the two ball oh was in, but man. she did come up dry. The two's laying perfect. The whole table's laying perfect. The three did the four is the only issue here. And uh, it's not that much of an issue looking at this layout. She she can get on the three real good with the way the two's laying. Good speed. Very nice shot. Don't get on the roof again. No, she's okay. She's okay. Yeah. Now she she'd like to go forward here if she could and go right up yeah right about where a cue is there yep. to take the angle to bounce off and get down to this bottom rail. She has the angle to get there. 
It'd be interesting to see her get out here and close the gap. Uh, now she's going to draw it down. No, it should be okay, yeah. Just a straight draw shot. Yeah. Actually, it's pretty good. Pretty good position for a draw. Yeah, she's okay. Just yeah, she's not going to draw into the corner. No, it's a stun draw shot. Yeah. She'll probably come down to, probably near that, first diamond. Right. Exactly. Or near the chalk. But right. I, don't I don't think she can power right. draw near right. the chalk. I think she'll be a little bit more toward the corner pocket. Right. Yeah. You don't have to do anything crazy here. No. Oh boy. And that was a little crazy. Man wow. overboard. Yep. Wow. You know, that could that could bite you in the end of this. Uh, that could come back and haunt you now. Because now it's going to cost you a game here. And who knows what's going to happen. It, you know, it could be tie in a minute. You know what I mean? Or 5-4, or you know. It's good. Yeah. It could cost her two games, that, that little mishap right there. It could. Murphy's Law. Nice shot. She needs to roll down. Need to roll down. Yeah. But she's good. Didn't think that didn't think that speed was gonna catch on. I wasn't sure if she was actually gonna make it down there or not, but she did. She's gonna draw this. Yeah, she's gonna draw this up. Whoa, what are you doing, Lori John? You got away with it. She couldn't make it. She had to s try to jack up and spin it you around. Think yeah. So? You, yeah, you she, don't think she wasn't, had the whole ball? No, she didn't have the whole ball. Seriously? You, did, I thought you said she got there. If she had the whole ball, she makes 20 out of 20 on that yeah. shot. I, I, I wasn't sure. Oh, I mean, okay. it was tough to see. I thought she, maybe she was trying to pocket it and draw off the short rail back up for the five, but I couldn't really tell from the angle I had. That's what I thought she had was doing it. I wasn't sure. So uh, left a hit. She did. You miss Cubo's going right back to where it is now. I was gonna say, yeah, yeah. Lloyd John can play very similar safety. Mm -hmm. She can thin this four. The four's gonna stay there because the five. I'm trying to get and behind put, that nine. Yeah, here. put the cubo right where it is now. She's in good line to get behind that nine too. Yeah. She's real close to her work. That's a big area to hide behind there. The other ball that got the six. Yep. yep, she got there behind the six. May have an edge. I think. Drop. I think she's behind the full ball. Yeah, the six. I, don't, I don't think she has an edge. She's already looking at the lower rail for a back kick here. Maybe uh, not a two rail kick. There's no reward there. You just need to. Well, I guess she's gonna send it. I don't see a kick safe here. Do no, you? I mean, she can go one or two rails here. She's running. You know, she went two rails. Well, well, here comes the safety. Another safety coming up. I don't think there's a window between the six and the nine here. Does right, she send slow it? down, Spock. Does she send it hey, to the Sparky, bo bottom down. rail? And um, I hate your guts, Al. <laughs> and Dennis, Dennis says you haven't been chastised. Right. <laughs> Dennis, who? We got to fulfill Dennis's needs over here. Nice safe. Left a left a left a piece of it. Dennis, who? Huh? Oh, he's reading the chat. I guess. Yeah. I don't know who he's talking about. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's gonna be. Jen didn't go here. She can. <coughs> she's gonna. She's gonna go two rails. Thin this. I don't think she can see the four at all. I think she's behind a full ball. You don't think she can hit the four? Seriously, with that window there? No. No, no four balls I right now. I guess not. She's going two rails, maybe even one rail. From, no. Yeah, one rail. She's one rail. No, she's going two. She's going to hit, hit that <coughs> third diamond, back up to the top rail, and hit the f come back and hit the four. See, she's using the... I thought she it looked had like right there she was using the middle point system. 
to kick it two rails like that. You put your and I do that, I use that quite a bit actually. It works really well. You line your queue up. You find the equal. Um, you find the distance between the. You find the distance between the four and the cue ball. Split it in half. The halfway point and the angle, of yep. course. Yeah, yeah. One, yeah. two. Which must made it. I actually like that kicking system. Um, I use that kicking system as well. I saw that, I believe, uh, the DVD I saw, and I believe it was Alex Pagulion that uh, I, saw, I learned that from, uh -huh. the two-rail kicking system. Safety play here. She got good. Watch that corner. Oh, she got real good. Wow. Well, here's a two-wheel kick. Oh, yeah. She'd be okay if she could just drive the four over to that rail because she, the seven's got the top pocket locked up. And there but you go. She's measuring the two rails again. Yeah, this is tough. She's frozen up on that rail up there. It's rough hit. Yeah, it makes it a little harder, but, like, I'm trying to think. If I were to look at that, where the two-rail kick would be, it's tough to, without actually measuring it, but it looks like it would probably be the diamond right after that side pocket. Really? Uh, I don't know. I, I could think be, wrong. be low. I think it'd be lower. Without actually measuring the shot. It's where it looks like she's aiming. Yeah, so I'm leaning to. I'm leaning more towards uh, the the middle diamond there. Even right. a little lower than I that, think maybe. You're too low. Yeah, I mean, it's just too. Wow, yeah, it was a little bit too low. Yep. But now there's no pocket for this four, so we're gonna need to see another safety here. And then you might see uh, somebody go on three type deal. I was going to you know? say, yeah, because yeah. if Lori John can lock her up here. Right, right. And Jennifer misses, that would put her on two. Yeah. And, you, and keep the ball over by that five and the eight. Some more stuff to hide behind after the safety here, you yeah. know. Damn. Unless she can't get the four there. It might be frozen. She may not have too many options to send the four and, and stick behind that six. But Damn. it looks like that's what she's gearing yeah. up for so maybe she does have it Dan parallel lines yeah absolutely like I said that's the middle point system where you have the parallel lines I actually like that kicking system myself you draw three parallel lines between the object ball the cue ball and the pocket you're kicking at oh she's going this way to hide behind the the 586 yep That's what she did, and she got it pretty good. Yeah, left her a one-rail kick here. Now, um, well, she's on one or two here. She's on one right she's now. She's on one. Okay. She has hit the four ball. Right. Um, and she is measuring the one-rail kick. Um. And so here's the thing. This would put her on two, so Laura John could try to run this out, or she could play a really easy safe and stick her behind the six and send the four ball up table. Wow, she's, See what looking, I'm saying? At, she's looking at a two-railer this way. Wow. Yeah, I don't know if I... Wow. I like the one-railer better than that because at least disturb it so she can't lock you up on the six if you're going to miss it. You know, at least... But let's face it, uh, ball in hand from here, you're supposed to get out anyway. But if you're on two and you can lock somebody up on that six, that'd be a great move. She's going up top to play this two rail. Look at this. Yep, she's going two rails. Four, five, six, this. seven, eight. I don't know. Yeah, she's the six yeah. ball. Well, well now that made it interesting because now Jenner, Jenner, she's... Jennifer is on two foul, but yeah. she moved the six ball to make it easy three foul. But it's Probably going to go for the run here. Yeah, it's a wide open table here. Oh, well, no, 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 no. The six, though. He, she has to get good on the five to come down for the six in the side because the nine's in the way. See it? 
I do, but I believe the six just plays in the side pocket. Well, yeah, but but she has to get good on the five to get there. That's all. Yeah, see, she's looking at that now. Right. She'll and with ball in hand, she's supposed she'll play the four in that far side, the other side, and and drift up for the five. She'll get for the oh, corner. Oh, she's going this way. Yeah, she'll play the four in the I corner. I would have drift back up for the five. I would have played it in the side, I think, and followed it up naturally. You know, just oh, she got great here. This is perfect. That's yeah. ball in hand position there. And once she pockets the six, she's going to be right in line for the seven. The eight doesn't go by the nine, maybe. Does it? I think it does. All right, well. She's. If it does, she's okay. Oh, she oh went she that, went way. that way. That's smart. That works, too. Yeah, that was better than pulling it down for the side pocket. Yeah. These side pockets can play a little tricky. Diamond. Three foul. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know what, guys? I like the three foul rule, too. However, um, it would have been a lot easier with the six ball next to the nine. It would have been a lot easier to three foul. I mean, Lori John is a BCA Hall of Famer. I would expect her to get out here. And that's another thing, too. When you've been, you know, you're down in a match, you want to shoot as much as possible. You want to get your stroke going. You want to get back in rhythm. It's been a long day for these players. No, it definitely has. So she'll stroke this. She'll play the seven. She'll draw yeah, she'll back off that long pocket. rail to play the eight in the side. Yeah, she'll go for the side here. She hit that real good. Uh, that's about perfect. Yep. And you got to be careful, too, with the speed of hitting bo those balls. These balls will jar, and they won't fall. Very see, nice. Uh, I see Sean Wilkie wrapping it up over there. I guess they're done, and I don't know the outcome. Uh, if I had to guess, I'd say Sean took it down. Yeah, I would. I would guess that too, but I don't know what the score is. Oh uh, yeah, but I'm not sure. Not to take anything away from Rob. So he gets out. Lori John gets out there and makes the score five to three. Chris, yeah, that was a great shot. That seven she, ball was great. She needed that five three instead of six two there. Yeah, right absolutely. There. Uh, Terry, three foul rule is if three if it's three consecutive fouls is a loss of game. Yeah, correct. And that's how George Rodriguez uh, uh, finished out his set on three. He got beat by uh, Kyle Pepin. Kyle Pepin, yeah. Kyle uh, Pepin beat him on three. On three, and that was the final. Yeah, George fouled out. Wow. Kyle plays good. Kyle did play good. Yeah, he played good against me. Yeah. Nice kid. Good kid. He won one of these Joss events, uh, <coughs> according to Mike Zuglin. He has won one of these. He has won a uh, Joss event. Yeah, he's come. He's a high finisher in a lot of other Joss oh, events. Good so for, good for him. Good kid. He's got this one in the side, baby. She has this one in the side, maybe, and to go yeah. into the two and send it over by the corner. There's no. Uh, you see it? I don't know if she likes the cut. I like it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Rich Connors. It was a main event, I think, actually. The main event up in Watertown. There's a who's that? Steve Reynolds' room. Uh, there's T.J. Billiards. There's a couple. T.J.'s is Steve's room. There's right? a couple rooms in right, Maine, right. I okay. believe. There's Union Station Billiards in Maine. There's a couple out in Maine. I've been to that one. They had a board up there from. Uh, she did do that. Nice shot. Yep. Um, a million years ago, there was a big tournament up there. The main event. Yep. And the, you had Efren on the board. You had everybody. Uh, yeah. Uh, um, I guess Miserac and it was straight pool. Player needs to be warned. Yes, Bob. Um, anytime a player is on two foul, your opponent has to tell you you're on th you're on two foul before you before your uh, opponent shoots. If they are not warned that it, they're on two and they foul, then the match still goes on. And they're on two now, <laughs> and they're still on two. Correct. Yeah, but there's no loss yet. So most people pretty much got it in their head to to remind anyone that. Yeah, you I have to say it. You have to say it. Well, it happened in my. It actually happened in my match. The guy, I think, I think the guy thought I was sharking him because he was on two. 
it was a wide open shot on the eight ball. I told him he was on two, but he's like, what do you mean? I'm like, you're on two foul. Yeah, yeah. He's like, well, you don't say that when I'm on a wide open shot. Yes, you know, I'm yeah, going to hit it. I'm not going to yes, scratch. Yeah. Well, finally, the referee told him and said, well, if you happen to foul yeah. and I didn't I didn't call you on two, then yeah. it's then the match still goes on. And I swear to God, it's happened to me before. And that's why I call every time now because sure you do. I put someone on two. Yeah. And um, I put yeah, someone on two fouls. You foul. have to say, you have to well, say he, it. Here's what happened. I put someone on two. Um, and then I scratched. So they had ball in hand. On, and so they had ball in hand. And I never told him he was on two. Right, right. He's got ball in hand. He's not going to miss ball in hand. He's not going to scratch off ball in hand. So what happened? I didn't tell him he was on two. Uh, he yeah. went to shoot. He went for a draw shot, and he uh, miscued. Yeah. Jumped the cue ball off the table, and yeah. the match still continued. And I was on the hill. Yeah, things happen. And the match still continued, and it, because I didn't tell him. And from that moment on, I always tell people that they're on two. Yeah. Hey, what did she do here? Sorry, I'm back. Oh, Sorry, guys. No. If, is that, if that's frozen, it may throw in. But if it's not frozen, uh, that's big trouble. There, it's heading for the point above the point, right? I can't tell from that angle. I can't. If it's frozen, it may throw. She might be able to throw it. It's going to need a lot of top right hand English. Oh, good oh, shot. There you go. Oh, she got good, too. Wow. She was fortunate that was frozen. Yeah. Well, I, get you tell. I don't know if she's going to try and draw this. Uh. No, that side pocket's sitting there. I don't know if he can draw this over and bounce over. And She's probably just going to have to roll forward on this seven ball. Go right past where the six is. I yeah, can't I tell the angle she has. If she has a little bit of angle, she might be drawing toward the side. So she might try and get it over as much as she can to the long rail and take the cut on the seven aside. But, yeah, this is a little touchy here. You better well, be careful. See, or she could do that, where, yeah. or she could shoot it and follow, like she's looking at. Right, it. She that, can shoot it and follow. With that move. would that would be the safer move, yeah. And it's at what well, was five three now? Yep. Wow. Yeah. You got to be. She is. She's you, aiming don't high. Give, don't give that. Don't give that lead away. What is he doing over there? And she just got distracted by. One yeah, of the, one of the workers here. He's gonna aim high. Yeah. Sorry, it's a safer you, bet. I mean, she. Sorry. Well, she, she could pull this down now and, and, and be okay. She'll draw this down. Yeah, she's fine here. You do have to make the ball, though. Yeah, she's straight enough where she can just draw her cue ball back pretty much right where her cue tip is. Well, not really exactly, exactly there, but she's got enough. She's got. She's straight enough, but she has a little bit of angle where she can just draw his cue ball back toward the nine. Oh, I wish I wish I could see some of these. Anybody? Are you reading the chat there? Yeah. Is anybody there looking at AZ Billiards know the score on Pat Fleming's match? I don't or, know. Uh, they're just finishing up now. They just finished, and I I'm just curious to know who won. Yeah, it, I, I don't know. No, it, no, it, no. The people in chat, if they're looking at yeah. the live street live scoring, we need a little help, guys. Can yeah. anyone yeah. watching the uh, live scoring? Jennifer for the win here. For the, uh, well, for the win of the rack. Win of the rack, yes. There you Actually, go. Six three. Jen goes up six, uh, six to three, and Pat won nine to four. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, guys. Way to go, Fleming. The old man's doing good. Seventy years yeah. old. Oh, he was doing. Yeah, he's doing great. Yeah. And from what Upset Al is telling me, that Pat Fleming is getting a diamond table. Yeah, in a couple weeks. I can't wait. Because he's been playing on my table every day. So <laughs> now I go across the wall and play on his. That's going to be good. Brand new diamond. It'll be a lot of fun. Well, he's got some crazy drills that he does. He's really he's really going to turn on the practice. And he's in pretty good shape. I mean, the man's, he rides a bicycle 220 miles in 12 hours. That's pretty strong. Yeah, it is. Alrighty, so we so I don't want to ride my motorcycle that long anymore. <laughs> you know. <laughs> so Jen's gonna look at the rack real quick. And she will break him up. 
So again, this is this format is winner break. Um, nine ball counts. Opponent anywhere. racks. Winner break. Um, nine balls wild counts anywhere. Um, and it's break from the box. You can't break from the side rail. You have to break from the box. Now she's back to her original break here, where she was pocketing everything. Nice. And she didn't do and it. And she she pocketed the cue ball. Yeah. Unfortunately. That doesn't count. <laughs> and well, well now, Jen, now Lori John gets to close the gap here. Uh, well, she's gonna try. I mean, it's a little tough with the two and the three on the rail like that. The but four I mean, five combo she's got. Yep. Yeah. She's got a pocket this two, and I probably come across one rail and try to get as straight as you can. Yeah, that four or five combo is doable, but you know who needs it? Let it's there at least. Yeah, she's just gonna stun this over and try to get in between the two and the three. Just don't come in that side pocket. Yeah, it's a big side, and she yeah, there it was found it. Yeah, and yeah. everybody was looking at it too. You know, just. No, this actually makes the a lot easier for Jen because yeah. now she can, with ball in hand, give herself angle. And shoot she's the looking two. at the four five also. Yep. She needs to. She needs to get out a little bit so she can get an angle on this uh, three ball. She'd like to like. She she'd like to stop after that three ball right on the six, which she'd be right in line for the combo. Yeah. There you go. So she's gonna shoot this three ball. She's yeah. got a little bit of angle here. She'll just try off that, drop it long rail, probably. Yeah, get past that six and she'll be good. Oh no, she wants no. to go from there. Looks like she's. That, that, she doesn't have too many options. That's it, she has to play the combo. Yeah, she's gonna come. And that, oh yeah. boy. No, she's good. Wow, yeah, she was. I thought she'd get a little kiss up that six yeah. ball, a little nudge, but it worked out for her. Worked out perfect. This is game ball right here, pretty much. Looking at this layout. Well, yeah. that was game ball anyway. You know what? Here's the safety. You know what the safety is here? Tell me. You double kisses dead in the face with a little bit of draw, and you leave it there. Send the cue back up to the top rail. Well, she's going to thin the left side of this and yeah, the cue ball up table. It's just a beautiful safety. I did it on Kyle before. That's yeah, a good shot. She's going to leave her long. She's going to. Lori John can see the four, but she's yeah. going to leave her long. Yeah, she may get re trapped, though, huh? She, can she send the four right back up to where she is and miss that nine on the way back? Because yeah, you'll have the six as a blocker. See it? Yep. Yeah, that's what she's looking at, I think. Send it right back to where the cue ball is and use a six. You don't have to do anything crazy. Oh, wait, what'd she do here? She tried to go behind the nine. Or you could do that. Well, she left an edge. I think she left more than an edge. I think. Yeah, she, yeah, yeah. I think Jen can actually bank this ball. And a big pocket with the seven over there. See it? Mm -hmm. Well. It's not really big because that means the side. I mean, you hit that seven ball, that four is not going to go. Unlike a big pocket with a corner. Yeah, yeah. And she, But she liked to play oh, a smart nice safety. safety. That was nice safe. Little cat and mouse game here with the safeties. She may powerless four, four right back down to where she is here. Leave her alone, right? She could. Or she could... Bank the four down toward the eight, but try to leave the cue ball behind the seven. There's a lot of traffic there, yeah. Yep. You're right. She she could actually go either way because she can. I like yours better now after looking at it. Yeah. Or she can hit, I mean, or she can go the way. She can hit the right side of it. Yeah, she could even, you know, yeah, bank it down on the right-hand side and even take the bank if she gets it. There's a lot of traffic to hide behind there, though. She went the other way. Yeah, you know what? That was tough to hold. And um, well, she got away with it, though. I think. I think that seven balls in the way. She may have an edge, though, to make it. 
even even though it's close. She's looking at it. Yeah, it might be it might be so close that you can almost almost make it, but not quite. It's that close, I think. We don't have an overhead overhead view here. She's got to kick at this. Look at this. She doesn't even have the edge to come down table and hide under the eight. You find that surprising? Does it look like she has the edge? No, honestly, I don't oh, think okay. she does. I think okay. she's. I think she's behind a full ball. Yeah, I wish I could see better here. I mean, if she can see the edge of that four, then she can make it. But she can't. So that's why she's kicking at it. And oh boy! You know what? She she kicked at it almost that. to make it too. She she wasn't far off. No, she was not. Well, you know what? Lori John needed this win right here, so uh, she gets these five balls here and she closes so. that gap a little bit because seven to three would be ugly yeah. in a race of nine. You know that's yeah scary number. Looks good there. She's a little, a little bit of angle. She can play the six on the side, roll up for the seven. Make sure she has angle to get that back down for the eight. Yeah, she'll get an angle to come down this bottom rail and be good. Yep. yep. So she's got enough angle now where she can. No, she, I think, unless she's too straight, but I can't really tell from here. She might have to come right back out to where she is and play the eight, you know, and then right where she is, you know. I don't think she's going to get down table now. Yeah, she's going to bounce out back to the middle and take the cut. That's a good move. Don't go getting crazy. Don't go getting crazy. She hit a... Oh, jeez. Oh, no, 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 no. Well... Oh, boy. She did she get away with it? No, she don't have this. I don't think. I don't think she's got this, no. I, I thought she should have took the cut and bounced out to the middle of the table. She let out the stroke there, thinking she was going to get there. Yeah, and she's, obviously, she's kicking at this. So yeah, she can't see boy. this. Boy, that was a big error. Well, she made a great hit, though. Yeah, she did. And she left Jim with a pretty tough cut. So she made a really good kick. Um, yeah, obviously, the way she hit that, she had she was the opposite angle but I actually agree with you I think she could have just come off one rail and just played yeah. the longer cut the problem with that though was I mean it was you can cut the eight but it would have been tough to hold with a nine for shape but yeah right, right. I mean you definitely wanted to I be thought she had to come under that under the nine after if, if she was gonna she I, really I was surprised well, that's what she tried to do she tried to yeah play around the table to go under the nines as you can play right. eight nine in the same pocket. I was I was surprised she uh I was surprised she did it, but she did. And this is the result here. She Danny De La Berde would have said she played into Snooker Dome. Yeah, I'm hoping Danny shows up here tomorrow. Is he supposed to be here tomorrow? Well I called him on the phone a week ago and, and he said he knew me and Pat were showing up here. He knew Pat was playing so and if he if you can get Good kick, good kick. If he can oh, get the, kick. if he get those guys from uh, Classic Billiards, uh, Carl's place to come out and drive him down here. I don't know if Danny's in any condition to drive. He just had heart surgery, you know. So mm. and he's about 84 now. Oh. How you doing, old man? If you're listening, hope you're well. Just got to take the cut here. Yeah, I actually like that kick that Jen did. Just, just hit a the back a kick. Hair. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty easy kick because you can measure up that back rail and hit and stick you as, know long as, you hit it, as long as you don't hit it too um, too thin and you can scratch off the back side of it but right. well nice shot that was a great shot by Laura John that was she let her stroke out on that one and you know on that back kick you know you're going to leave them long you know yep it's good as stuff as, yep well she needs this nine ball here close this gap up no, she definitely does There you, there you go. go. Boom. Lori John goes up. Up by one. Six to up four. Uh, is down six to four. Well, she, yeah, yes. Lori John was up a rack, but yes. yeah, she still trails Jennifer by a score of six to four. 
That game could have went either way a couple times. All right, several innings in that game, I think. Yeah, a little bit of a safety play. Yeah. And uh, like I said, a little, little, little cat, cat and mouse game, but we're racing the nine. It's six to four in favor of Jennifer Beretta, but Lori John to break. Uh-oh. Oh, there's a new ball. No, she pocketed a ball. A shot on the one. Wow. You won't get on the 2-9 here, but she will get on the two in the left side. Yeah. Unless she can... No, she ain't getting on the 2-9 here. Would be ideal if that four wasn't sitting there. Wow, she played for it. I didn't think she could miss the four. Well, this ain't a gimme either. Remember you were talking about combinations before. Remember that? The two plays. Yeah. You yeah, the two plays past the nine. Does it really? Or she could be playing the billiard. I don't know. I really can't see if she... No, there's no billiard play. No, she's playing the two into the nine or playing the two... Oh, she played yeah, the combo. It wasn't. It just. She played the combo and. You know, I mean. Didn't get away with anything here. She he, she has a shot on the two. Yep. Uh, uh, and and you know what? The way this is laying here, she's gonna send this cue ball up and around, up down, up and down, three rails to get on this three. Do you think? Yeah, I mean, I would probably. I'd probably cut this with a little bit of inside and, and then yeah, come up. Up to the top rail. Yeah. And it might end up perfect. Plays a little tricky, but. Yeah, oh, no, it's not a hanger by any means, but it seems sure. like the logical way to play it. Yeah, I'm sure Jennifer is very capable of playing the shot, so. No, she went for speed somehow. Look what she did. She tried to miss that nine there and put, went for speed. Well, oh, the two's hanging. I'm sorry. No, she oh. hung up the two. Oh, yeah, I couldn't even see it there for a second. I thought she made it. This is another mess here uh, to get on the street. This is no. Oh, you know what? She does have. She has the three off the six in the side. So play rail first here, and you're going to get good on the three in the side. You could almost hit it with a snow shovel. Just got to get good on it. Oh, a little strong. No, I think she'll be okay. No, oh, she got good, yeah. She's good. And the, and the four is up table, so she can let the stroke out here and get up table also. Yeah, she's going to get on the four now, too. Go forward and bounce off the rail, right? Yeah. Just doesn't want the six, seven disturbing anything right. with the four ball. Yeah, I agree with you, Diamond. I believe the two did pass. She went for the two nine, I guess. I, I mean... I don't know. Maybe it didn't because I don't think she would have oh, played as a combo without. She's drawing this ball. I would go forward with this with, with a little touch of inside, I think, and you don't even need the inside. You're going to send the cue ball back up to the four after yeah, you make the three. It's going to be perfect. That's it. Top. That's it. Right there. Now she's got it. It was nice to wait for the six laying there because there was no way she was getting on, the, on that three anywhere else. Nice shot. Uh, Mike, Al Al's taking a little bit of a break. He, uh, he's he been on this all day, so he's taking that a little bit of a break for right now. Is she, sending, is she cutting this four or sending it back down to the table and hiding behind the 6-7? Look at that. That's a good safety right there. Yeah, she can definitely play safe. Yeah, I mean, she could go. I like the safe. Though. I like playing the four, sending the four down the table and putting the cubo behind the seven. I think she's cutting the four in. I think she is. Looking at the back of her cue, it looks like she's lined up for the cut. Oh, she did cut it. Okay. Yeah, I yeah. really couldn't tell from where she was aiming. but I yeah. could only tell from the back of her cue the way it was lined yep. up. You know, That works, though. Well, the two, she has to play the six inside. So 
She got good on the five for that. Yeah, so. she's good. She'll just pocket she, the five, roll down for the six on the side. This five ball is game ball. She'll roll up perfect for this, and, and then she'll be dead in the line. Yeah, she did good. There you go. She's good. She'll pocket the six. I mean, she could be... She probably to roll down. She can be straight on this. She can be wherever really she wants to be. Yeah. Because the nine ball is almost in the middle of the table. As long as she's not stretching for something, that's all. That's all she needs to be concerned with. Right. And she's going to close this gap to one game here. This is it's a, a battle. Big game. And, yeah, so she... Yeah, she could draw down to the middle of the table now. Yeah, she'll just straight draw. Pretty good stuff. A battle. I thought Jennifer was really going to run away with it for a minute there and, mm -hmm. and switch back and forth. Uh, you can never, ever count Lori John out. No. She I mean, came back on... BCA Hall she, of Famer, I mean. Yeah, she came back on uh, Annie before. Also, Annie was up, I thought, about 5-2 to two at one time, I thought. Well, Annie's playing phenomenal also, so yeah, she you really is. can't take anything away from either no, one of those no. ladies. There you go. And I just, that's a very confident stroke right there by Lori John. Six to five now. And breaking. And breaking is correct. Makes it a little bit closer. Uh... Bernie, yeah, if you play these shots with, you know, like um, pocket speed, then they will drop. Um, you just got to be, you know, watch your speed and be careful. Because these diamond tables, if you hit them a little hard, they'll bobble and they'll stay up or they won't drop. Yeah, they're accepting a lot of shots at soft rolls. Yeah, it's, yep. you can get away with a little bit. So uh, let's see this break. Let's see the, look at the three ball. Three ball went high, cue ball. ball went right in the nine side, and the hanging. nine ball, well, it's not hanging. No. It was looking, looking like it was going to for a minute, but it didn't. I'm wondering if it's shootable. No, maybe not. No. No, no, no. No, no, no. Don't you even say that. Take a look. I'm looking. <laughs> it ain't my fault if she shoots it. No, nah, you can't do it from there. Oh, she's looking at the far. Wow. Come on, I know you guys are in the chat. You don't shoot the 1-9 here. Help me out here. No, Eddie the lock. No, no, Come you, on. No, you don't. No. What's wrong with you? You do not. <laughs> Steve's fault. <laughs> <laughs> My fault. He's glad, the one saying glad it. Glad to see you admit it, too. Yeah, no, no, no. No, no, no. I do not. <laughs> I know you didn't. I don't like combos as it is. I definitely wouldn't play that. So that's why she's, oh, she's on the roof. Look at this. Yep. Wow, with ball in hand, there's no reason for that. That was a little bit of carelessness there, you know? Yeah, she's going to try to force follow here. Yeah, go to the top rail and a little bit inside maybe. Or just get Turn. there. Oh, she went that way. No, she had a no, pretty good stroke no, on that one, but unfortunately, good. yeah. Now she plays the billiard and plays the nine, see it? Yep. Steve said. You know what? She has a carom here. Look. She does, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that one I would, okay, all right. I'll give, you funny. I'll give you credit on that it's one. It's a two-way shot. She's going to send the three down and play the carom. Yeah. And she's close to her work. Yep. She has no business being where she is. She got so bad with ball in hand on that one. Well, he, she should never be Here's where the thing. You you play, the, you play the three. You play the nine carom. Yeah. And the cue ball goes pretty much where she is now. So it is kind of yeah. like a two-way shot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just you don't have to call the nine. It is wild. So. Yeah. It's just unfortunate that. Well, she's not sending with any any speed, you know. She's no. But I think you've... It's a natural two-way shot, you know. It's You're going to save on the three. You're going to leave the cue ball up here, and you're going to leave long no matter what. But you, and don't get me wrong, that's such a tough cut with a carom here. But you're close to that pocket. you got to shoot it. Right. That's what I think she's going for. I think she's going for the carom. Yeah. And the so save. Thin hit on the three. Yeah. Well, that's that's exactly what it. she did. Oh, look at our reward. And she made it wow. inside. It now, yeah. Well, it works. Yeah. Yeah, Diamond, I agree. That nine ball was, I mean, that, that Karen was 
dead. You know, I don't know if she has this five in the side past the seven. Uh, she could use that five in the side right now. Yep. Uh, and and draw over to the long rail and down, but I think she may have the side pocket here with the with the five ball after it's four. Uh, Christine, yes, earbuds are allowed for this event. Just for a heads up, I see your question. Yes, they are allowed. Oh, she's got the other corner now. Okay. Some tournaments they're not, but this one was allowed. She's going into the seven here. Needs to be careful. She doesn't scratch in the side. You see that? Well, she's going to... Yeah, she's mm. playing the five in the corner. She's going to hit that seven, though. And she needs to hit it full. If she, if she can. Well, no. Or she she's going to draw above it. No, she wow. just... Uh, she got bad. Uh -oh. Well, she kind of got away with it, but the seven ball right there. Yeah. Rail first here. Wow. Wow. This is a tough rail first here. Nice hit. Whoa. And oh. big, big pocket. Big, yeah. Big pocket. There's your big pocket. Yeah. The nine ball and makes that and five and ball huge. She, she draws it down. She'll get the six. She can let out the stroke here too. Yep. And not sweat anything here. She's going to fall on the six real good here. Yep. You could almost hit this right in the face. It's going in the hole. Right? You could, yes. Yeah, you could almost hit this straight. Yeah, that five ball's pretty big with yeah, that nine ball sitting yeah. there. She's going forward. Look. Yeah, she... No, maybe she's yeah, just lining yeah. up. Yeah. But you do need to... You need to snatch this back, though. I just want to cut in here for a quick question, a uh, quick answer. I'm sorry, guys. I'm kind of getting a little tired. Uh, huh? First match tomorrow will be 10 a.m. will be Torsten Holman and Kyle Pippen Ooh. on the stream table, 10 a.m. Uh, way to go, Kyle. Go get him. Uh, Thorsten had an early loss. Uh, I don't know who he lost to. Uh, he lost to uh, West. Oh, Kevin, Kevin West. West. Kevin yeah. West, wow. He beat him 9-4. Yeah. Wow, good win, Kevin. Yeah. Uh, Toasty, uh, I guess Toasty is going to come back with a vengeance. But Kyle, mm -hmm. uh, you know, he can run him too. So yep. we'll see what happens tomorrow at 10 a.m. Are you on, are you on stream at 10 a.m., Al? I was on about uh, You were on this morning? Yeah. This morning? Oh, really? I didn't know. You were down here. Yeah, well, I thought you started at like noon. Well, I usually turn the cameras on so folks can enjoy it at home. And then we do official commentary at noon. Yeah. But, we, you know, we were sitting here, and we did, like, oh. half the match, which oh, good, was pretty good, cool. Oh, good, good, good. Yeah. Well, and, and, and you, do, you don't want to miss Thorsten anyway, you know. No. Uh, That's a good move. If I'm up early, I'll come down even earlier. You know, it's just uh, well. a matter of trying to get a couple hours. Yeah. Seven to five here but now. She, yeah, she ran this rack nicely. Well, not yet, yeah. but. Yeah. You jinxed her now. Way to go. You already said she won the rack. <laughs> who jinxed who? <laughs> yeah, but I'm allowed to jinx him. Jeez, Al, help me out. <laughs> help me out here. Al, yeah, don't give him no help. He's fair game. <laughs> these, these microphones are very sensitive he's, when you yell like that. It's fair game. I hear you. That's why I built this wall, really. Yeah. Got gotcha. you. Okay. Yeah. yeah, way to go. He sharked her on the shot now. Jennifer Breda nice, nice extends the lead 7-5 <laughs> right now. It's wanna, I want to thank Steve Sutton and uh, Ed Colhane sitting in, uh, really pulling up the uh, the tail end of the Friday night. We're having fun. Oh well, yeah, I mean, want to thank you, Al, for doing this, doing the Appreciate setup and the commentary, and but uh, you guys really come through uh, tonight for sure. And I know you help out a lot, both of you. Yep. But tonight, I'm uh, really, I'm out of it. I'm, well, I, I'm gone. I had two people come fine. up to me and said, Al, you look like you're shot. <laughs> I said, Yeah, I am shot. Yeah. It's it's a it's a long week. You don't look that shot to me, Al. Huh? Uh, well, yeah, I, right. yeah. I mean, you come made on. your bed. You you, <laughs> you made your bed. You're <laughs> damn right. <laughs> I told you to go to medical school. <laughs> Jennifer Breda set the break. She leads here by two, seven to five. I mean, you, what you got here Tuesday? I mean, yeah, it's it's a long week for you. I got here two days prior. Yeah, yeah, it's a long week for you. 
Well, because I had the new cameras, and I, I was afraid that I still don't have the settings the way I want. I mean, they actually... Uh, Which are phenomenal, by the way. These cameras are awesome. You. So they I was really kinda, are. I was on edge about getting them uh, no, tested, tested, and that's why I got here two days early. All right, she's going back to that original really? break here. And four in the corner, is that it? What is Darren that? Myers. On the five. Yeah. That's Darren she's Myers. Four. The four? Is that the four? Darren Myers from Staten Island. He only comes on when the girls play. He don't come on any other uh -oh. time. Uh-oh. I'm kidding. Uh-oh. Needs well, a miracle here. Well, everyone's coming oh. to help, but I think she can still pocket the one ball. I think Kelly so, Kelly Isaac. Hi, Kelly. And? NJ pool player, Troy. And, and then we, we got Sparky in the booth. We're going to change the lock's name to Sparky. No, you know what, Junior? That happens to be your name, all right? So don't go stealing my equipment, all right? <laughs> Using all my material. Creeps. She's going to... Tough two ball here, right? To yeah, get on unless, this she, unless she gets in between the four or six. To get around? She no, had to. she went behind the yeah, six. That was, yeah, oh. That's two up in the corner here. And then now, uh, this is tough to hold for the three down here. She's got to draw this down. With the angle she has, yeah, yeah it's, it's tough. There's a nice safety play down here. Send the two parallel right down. She's playing this two ball, of course. Tippy says, Eddie the, go Eddie the Gopher? Tip, nice shot, nice That's shot. A great shot. Nice shot. Look at this. She'll draw yeah, for the four on the side now. Yeah. She's, under, she's under the six, too. In fact, the 4-7 might be wired. You know? But she does have the four on the side. No, yeah, I think she'll... Yeah, she'll draw it up for the four on the side. Yep. Nice shot. That'll work. Nice speed, everything. And then she's going to be in stop, Four, stop, five. stop mode yep. after this now. She's uh, going to, well. She's threatening. She's yeah. And she's she needs to. Otherwise, Jennifer gets on the hill. Right. You know? You, yeah. And that's good. That's when it gets scary. Yeah. That's definitely not something you uh, want to see is Jennifer Brett on the hill. But this is, looks like a pretty easy out here with the five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, a little bit of. I want to play the six in the same corner. Inside, I think sh I think she'll play the six in the side. I think she'll uh, play the five, roll like that, and play the six in the oh side. That's a good move. Did a little touch of inside yep. there, yeah. Touch of inside. We'll put the six inside. Roll up for the seven. Yeah. You just gotta look and see where you want to be from the eight to the nine. Right. The eight to the nine is the only sweat. Just want to make sure you have. Angle. Uh, I thought no. she could have come up there a little bit better than that. She could have. She's okay, though. She'll just pocket a seven. She'll send the cue ball up table back down. Well, yeah. But leave I herself mean, angle. It was unnecessary work there. She could have went forward better, I thought. Oh, she's drawing this. Look. Well, that'll give her, that'll, that'll give her angle. She's eight, drawing too. it over, yeah. Kind of surgery. Oh, that's a good shot. Oh, perfect. Now she's. Now she's fine. Yeah. She's perfect where she can come one or two rails right back down, down the table for the nine. Yeah. Yep. And uh, closing the gap. One game deficit after this uh, nine ball. She hit that real good. There it is. One, two rails down for the nine, straight in the pocket. She doesn't hit too many shots. Bad. She's no. tired right now. Well, she has no, had. Uh, she 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 messed up a few in this set. Uh, yes. That was surprising too. But yeah. she's also not going to let you lay down and run right now. Oh, no, 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 you know what I mean? You're going to yeah. have to beat a seven six. But she trails by yeah, one. Yeah, yep. she missed stuff she would never miss. Kind of things that a couple times was surprising. No, I mean Lori Johns had a great stroke. I mean. And Jenna's not going to lay down either. Neither one of them. That's correct. Seven six though. I mean, this is uh, ever so close. It's now 11.47 p.m. on the East Coast. It was a coin toss from the go, pretty much. Let's see what happens with this three ball. Lori breaks them really nice. Yeah, she does. No, that no one ball, a no little high. Ball, another dry break. Just no one ball shot. They're struggling to find that sweet spot on the break right now. You know, the safety here is... Uh, Nice little safety. Yeah, you yeah. know what? That that one may almost come off the eight. 
and go back down table, and you could roll forward and hide under that mess there. I like just sending the one behind the stack and leaving the cue ball next to the eight. I don't think you between can. Between the two eight, yeah. I think it's coming off the eight between where you can't do eight. that. Now you yeah, get she couldn't do that. Now she's going to get punished for that. Mr. Michael Casamassima. You see the safety coming up here? Yeah, there's a yeah. pretty... And there's such a cluster. Nobody's getting out here anyway, but... I mean, you can just... She's going to probably bank this one ball back down table. Or she's... Yeah. Oh, she's going to hide gonna behind put it the that one way? Ball, yeah. I liked it the other way. I like the cue ball behind it. Yeah. She can do either one. But yeah, she decided to... That works. Is there a window between that 4-8? It looks like there might be. No, I think she's behind the full ball on the 8-ball, I think. Uh-oh, look, she's looking at the window, see? She's looking at it. Yeah, yeah. There you know, if there is a window and she even has the edge, she'll cut that one in. But there's no reward there. The two's all jammed up. Right. So just get the solid hit. And don't worry about, don't worry about anything else. Just make sure you get the hit. That's why I kind of like banking the one ball, leaving the one ball near the 4-7 and leaving the Oh, she did get nice the cut. Shot. Wow. She had the whole ball. Yeah. She yeah, did. Yeah. Um, but there's no reward with this two ball here. She can play a save. Oh, you know what? And play the save. Drive the seven to the rail and float past the 4-8 and use the 4-8 as a blocker. She's got a good save coming up here maybe. As long as she doesn't scratch. Don't scratch, right, right. right. Don't come off that four and go in the hole. But the seven is going to be the saver to, to cinch the uh, no foul. Oh, she really let the stroke out there, too. She got under this three? Oh, my God. There's a hole. Uh, yeah. She found the hole. That's not good because everything's wide open here now. Yep. And, and, uh, and uh, Lori John needed to tie this up, so this is a home run for her right here. This is a big opportunity. Yeah, she just needs to. Got to just get to work. Yep, yeah, yeah. exactly. And do this is the kind of pressure that she thrives on. Yeah. She thrives on this. Just. Do what those years of experience have taught you on the pool table and just, like Alice said, go to work. Excuse me. Oh, my God. Somebody please shut Ed up. You can't. I tried. We put him in handcuffs. We taped yeah, I don't him know up. who these people think they are. <laughs> Probably your cousins. <laughs> <laughs> are they aware I have their house keys? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Tell them to calm down. Calm down there, Brian. Or else Sparky's coming after you. <laughs> With your house keys. Just don't bump the eight. Don't feather the eight at all. Good shot. That's a good shot. There it is. Yep, she's good. Wow, and she's going to get good on the seven, too, after this, with that well, shot. Oh, the six ball. Nice. With, 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 with get on, she'll get good on the seven because of that six, the way it's laying there, you know? Does she go two rails underneath it and shoot it up in the left-hand corner? That's what I like. She could um, she could just go one rail and shoot it in the side. come across the other side of the table. There, you got to yeah. stay low on a six if you're going to do that, so you can naturally float up with yeah, a seven, right? Yeah, yeah. It's yeah, it's completely personal it, preference. Looks it, like she's gonna. It's just laying pretty good for all in all, you know. Let's see what she does. She got to get low on it, and she did. Oh, she got low. She'll get on the short side now. That's okay. Stay away from the pocket. Yeah. She's pretty straight on it. Uh, off a little bit. She hit that really good. Very nice. Well, probably want to come down a little further yeah, than that down yeah. toward that where that first diamond is, but She's she'll be okay here. She needs to get the speed right here. Uh, She's yeah. probably fine. She's coming back and forth. She's going to yeah. cut the seven in and go up and down table for the eight. Just watch the speed. Make the ball. That's a phenomenal shot right there. Just stay yeah, off that rail. Right. She's good. 
and she got that little gap in the side pocket yeah. there, g helping her out a little bit. You know? She hit that ball really good. Yeah. Yep. She's got to draw this back. And and she executes this draw back to the rail, and this is going to tie it up for her. Yeah. A real battle. Nice shot. Race to two coming up, folks. Don't go anywhere. Don't give it a black cat, Ed. It would have been Steve's fault. Nice there shot. you go. Seven, seven. There what a go. match these ladies are putting on. We hope you guys are enjoying this at home or wherever you might be as much as we are here. And we still have people in the uh, the audience on oh, the left and the right side. Yep. That's nice to see. Still quite a few spectators watching this. Yes. In fact, uh, you know what? Lori John is actually one of the directors for UBL Now. Go over to ublnow.com. Oh. Website and get all the information. Oh, that's Mike Siegel's twenty. Mike Siegel yes. and Pete Mago. Yeah, PD. Hey, Pete, if you're watching. Jennifer racked them up and Lori X will re rack. Here we go. She's been coming up uh, dry, right? Well, watch she, the watch the three ball, three, yeah. ball, three ball, swing ball. She's been making them. No, no, not. No, they're trying to find the sweet spot. And yeah, they've been. Might have to amp it up a little bit more. Yeah, again, still hit high. Nine yeah. ball but counts. Nine ball would have yeah. counted. Yeah. Wow, that would have been a quick rack to change things around. You think? Yeah. yeah. Big big swing. This, the, way this is, the way this is looking, it might be quick anyway. Look at this table. What, what do you like here? The two ball going into the nine. And she got the four five combo again. Do you, like, do you like Jennifer Beretta Vanessa in this cue ball to the left side of the table where she put the chalk down? Oh, is that shooting the, the two oh, nine combination? What do we like here? Oh, talk to me, talk to me, that's, talk to that's me. That's the ball. five that's up here. She's going to zigzag back and forth to get, that, and forth to she get gets, the two. She gets right where the chalk is and she can play this two nine. Yep, I agree with you. And oh, she bumps no. it, she could play it too. Oh, she no, did. she's going to play what, She did what she should have done. Very classy there. move right there. Yeah, she's going to play the out now here. Al, Al's medication her. kicked in. They talked about that two nine Listen, combo. Listen, she's playing a champion. She's not playing just another young right. lady on the tour, you know, on the league. She's playing a, a, a world champion here. BCA Hall of Famer. Hall of Fame player, you know. Come on. Al's, Sometimes uh, you, uh, Al's, not that Al's very not, tired right now. Not that Jennifer's not seasoned. You know, if you, it, I bet you if it was laying in a different he's very way tired. and it was easy to get on, I bet you she, I would have went for it, wouldn't have yeah. you? He's stuttering. Yeah. He's starting Listen, to stutter. Hey, let, me, let me tell you a little bit about Eddie's <laughs> last match. Eddie's last match, he had five combinations. I hate four, your four get out of here, man. He's Pat talking Fleming's about Kyle Peppins. I know. It was, get oh, away from no. me. Kyle, oh, Kyle Pat, told me. Pat Fleming, <laughs> Pat Fleming and I were talking. Pat Fleming, oh, I said, man. wow. I said, how is Eddie by beating Kyle Pippen? I said, well, you guys a good combos. Oh, you Pat says, you don't know. He's shooting uh, so good. You lying. He Pat. says he's up 4 nothing. He only made four balls. <laughs> <laughs> That's nine ball for you. All right, here's back to the match. Back to the match. Yep. This four is the five up in. top. Yep. I thought it was the four. No, four fours. fours in the pocket. Yeah, yeah. it is. And, and I had to get up and look at the table because I couldn't tell the colors. Oh, she's got this real first. Yeah, but that's a little deep, but she can make it. And with the right speed, she's going to come around and get good on the five. Maybe even like that. Look at that. What a shot. Well, she overshot a little bit, but all in all, she's there. And the six goes in the side. Yep. She just needs to pull this over and bounce off the long rail. And, uh, well, you know what? They're going on the hill here, whoever wins this, so yep. this is a big game. Is she pulling this over? She's drawing this ball, you think? I think she, she can follow her. She can't go straight into it and 
she'll go into the 89. Right? She, yeah, she had to hold yeah. it. She oh, did. Boy. She. That's tough. Not to mention the pressure here. Oh, unfortunately. Yeah. And Lori Johns, and uh, there's definitely a momentum swing in this match because Lori Johns was down by like three racks, and now all of a sudden we're looking at a tie game. That six down in the corner might, no, might, I was going to say it might you be know. a big pocket, but no. now that nine's in the way now. So she has to, oh, she could play the side pocket and bounce, come back up and down, right? She, I mean? she could, I mean, or... Now she's she, looking at the pocket. There. Well, she's looking at pocket and the five and coming down off the top rail and seeing where she wants to be on the six. Yeah, she was just seeing if the six would pass, but... Uh, but she's straight enough she, where she... I don't think she'll even hit the top oh, rail. You know what? She might elect to go for that six ball in the corner. She did, look. Yeah, she is, yeah. She likes it. Six in the corner. You know what? It's doable. I guess it's doable. Oh, of course it is. Yeah. Six in the corner, seven in the side, eight, nine. That's what I like. And it was a big pocket. Well, now that it makes well, that yeah. makes it easier. There's no combo now. That was game ball right there, yeah. So seven, eight, nine, same pocket. Yeah. And for someone who was down by four racks, I think now it. What she did was it four really? I, oh, you I know what? You're so. probably right. You're probably right. I think so. Yeah. And she did the same thing before now against Annie. She came back on Annie too. Threatening to get to the hill first. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of comfortable position, right? Speaking of, P Pat Fleming's right behind you. Nice win, spook mister. Up on you. Nice win. Nine four, nine five. What was it? I had to ask the people on the chat room because I seen you unscrew, and I said, oh, "Good for you." All right. Well, this nine ball will put Lori John to the hill. Lori John up eight. Two seven and breaking. This happens to be one of the last matches of the night, looks like. So there's a lot of people around this table watching this match. Now she needs to change this breakup. She's been coming up dry, and she's in the same position every time here. Yep. I'm not, I'm not going to tell this woman what to do because her knowledge is over the top. But <coughs> right. Change it up somehow. And she hasn't been executing anything on the break here. And, and I believe this is the last match of the night, and play will resume 10 a.m. Big match tomorrow, tomorrow Thorsten and Kyle Pepin. Yeah. Big match tomorrow. Yeah, I wonder if his opponent's going to start making, like, five nine-ball combinations on him, too. All right, anyway, back to the break. Lori John hitting the four ball. Or watch the four ball. Sorry, not hitting. Watch the four ball, the wing ball. Yeah, again, dry. It went high. It went a little high. It was a dry break, so Jennifer Breda will come to the table. <laughs> well, you got Thorsten in the morning playing Kyle. Yeah. Sean Morgan, Alaska, is playing Pat Fleming at 10 a.m. Oh, yeah. all right, that'd be a good one. Uh, they played the last time, and last August they 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 matched up here. I wonder if Kyle's opponent tomorrow will make like six nine-ball combinations like you did against them. I did, I did not. <laughs> Way to go, man. Hey, I talked to Kyle. You jump can't on, trick me. I've talked jump to Kyle. Jump on that bandwagon. Hey, I'm not jumping on anything. Kyle, talk to me. He got lucky. <laughs> now nah, he's a good kid. I, I wish him the best. Real gentleman. He played good. No, nah, he's a good guy. Uh-oh, hey, that's no good. You know, she caught the third diamond there. That's not going to fall. Maybe at that speed it would have fallen. At the you know what? Leaves a real first, though. Have. Yeah. Got a real first window. Yeah, I don't think she can. And watch the watch the uh, scratch on the rail first. You might come off the one and eh, maybe no, not. No, the four ball is there. I don't think he'll scratch. And it could be close. I think she'll come rail first. It's going to be tough getting on that two ball. No, it will be. So 
That's well, that'll work. Yeah, that's not too bad. Oh, you gotta kick this from the bottom, I guess. Hit it in the face and send it up a little bit. Hope you can stick there and hide behind that four ball. That would be ideal, but that's kind of tough, I think. Yeah. I thought she's going too long here on this. Uh, you just can't hit the back. She like needs, the, yeah, hit she the back side, you'll scratch off of it. Right, right. She needs a. Wow, great she hit. She hit that absolutely wow. perfect. That was world class hit right there. A little bit scary, you very, know, close to the pocket, very, you know. Very, very nice kick by. I had a lot of confidence Jennifer in it. Beretta. Yeah. Look at this. You can't hit a kick better than that. One rail kick here to the bottom rail, because the nine's messing things up for you here. Well, I think she's frozen to the back of that four ball, so yeah. that makes that hit on that one very difficult. Because I don't think you can go to the either long rail. I don't think she can go to that no, rail. No, and and being fro being frozen there. You can't even tie anything up from here. No. Nope. Yeah, because you can't even go to the opposite long run because the nine ball right. lets you try to. Yeah, you can't. I, I don't know. There's nothing to tie up. She's got to go with English right here. Yeah, she's in two rails. No, no, well. No, she's going to go long, long and try to be like a one, two, just there, like that. Wow. Great hit. Good hit, good hit. And, and got away with it. Yeah, she got a little reward. A little pretty bit of good reward. stuff, pretty good stuff. And being on the hill, that doesn't hurt. This this whole game took a big turn, didn't it? It did. Uh, Karen Core, yeah, Karen Core was not here at Turning Stone. No, Karen. She did not play this time. Somebody mentioned yesterday. I asked about Karen Core. Uh, and I, I don't want to be mistaken here. I thought somebody said uh, had a problem with her back or something. I, I oh, don't know. Really? I don't know. But she was a tough competitor here. She's kicking this two rails. Well, she's a tough, tough competitor. Tough competitor anywhere. She yeah, plays. she is. One, two, very nice. Oh boy, that! Look at this! Look at this! Look at this two ball. She's going right behind. Look the at two. that! Look at that! Wow. Boy, she needed that too. Not you know at at eight seven. She Jennifer. That was big. Oh, absolutely. That was a game winning safety right there. Well, it was a. She was kicking to hit the uh, ball. Kicks, kick I mean, safe. Yeah. Kicks, yeah. It just happened to work out, you know. I mean, it's like she saw the safe. She kicked to hit the ball, and, you know, she made a good hit, got a good result out of it. Yeah, so she did catch the top of that one to go her. up the table, so good for her. I think she's hit this pretty hard to cut this angle down to go one rail to the one. Yeah. Oh, nice hit. Or not. Look at this. The other oh, way. oh, oh. Well. We might be looking at cheeseburger, cheeseburger here if, uh, well... The two balls uh, stretch here. You're going to bounce out and play the two up in the top corner. Yeah, I think she'll just roll this one ball in. And then the three needs a window for this lower corner. I don't think it goes by the four here. No, three ball play on the side. Well, you're up by there for the two, though, and you can't. Yeah, I think she'll get there. I have confidence in her. Yeah, getting on the three here in the side could be a well, strike. Well, maybe. Yeah, I mean. I think she could have been. She, I think she wanted to be a little bit straighter, but to draw straight back. But Does she bounce all the way back over for the three in the lower left hand corner? This is a tough shot, no matter what she does here. Not I don't sure. know if she's going to hold this for the side, though. I think maybe if she doesn't, she has to bounce back and cross for the three. Does she, does she not? She might. It's not desi not desirable by any means, but it's there. She did. Wow, nice shot. Oh, look at this. Great shot. Wow. Three in the that side. That was well now. hit. That oh, was really well hit. Well struck ball. Very nice. She had three in the side. Yeah, and she'll just bounce five. down. Yeah. yeah, I mean. The six ball's the only sweat. Yep. Because it's only got one pocket. I think she needs to bounce in the, off the bottom rail here. But she's going to slow roll it. Look. Oh, no, she's not. Oh. Wow. I wasn't expecting that. I thought she would have 
would have uh, stunned it down and bat bounced up, you know. You know, um, the angle she, he's going to have on this five ball is perfect to go up for that six. If she could stop right there, shoot the five up in the corner, she'll float over for the six, and that's the angle she needed. Yep. And she needs this just to go hill hill. She she can't afford to miss this. Not that she's going to miss this ball. She can't afford. No, nope, that's good. perfect. Wow. Yep. Perfect so shot. Shoot the five. Roll up. Yep. Get up near the spot if you can. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. But she's got a natural angle, so just pocket yeah. this ball. She's going to get better than the spot here. No, yeah, she's. Yeah, she could even get yeah. in line with that chalk there, you know. Yeah, she's at natural angle. Yeah. So just roll the ball in. Right. Keep just cinch it. Tracking. And, yep. A little bit of top. Yep. Perfect. There you go. Jennifer Beretta bringing it. And the 7 to the 8 shouldn't be a problem, no matter whether you're above it or below it. Right. And you take the 9 on the side from there if you need to. This is a key ball right here. Do not yeah. miss this ball. Just She just wants to make sure she doesn't. Yeah. She's going to avoid that side pocket. That's what she was looking at. She just, you know, didn't like it. She got up. You know, as a veteran player, you don't like something, get up, reach off. Reset. Refocus. And yeah. A lot of people won't stand up and think, oh, I don't have to stand up. And that's what they're thinking about yeah. while they're down in the shot. Should I stand up? Nice shot. Very nice. She oh. came off that, ni that nine ball nicely, too, to yeah, worked, bump up. That worked out. And I think she's... Draw this down to about the middle diamond. Yep. Or even past it. She could still... You know, she'd rather be by the middle diamond. Yeah, she's going to... Uh, she still has a nine on the side if she wants after the eight. Just a stun draw. Just like that. Nice shot. Yeah, that was it. Yeah, she should take the nine on the side from here, I think. Nine on the side, or she could, if she wanted to, roll up higher and play the nine in the corner, but I think she'll play this side. Yeah. She was just eyeing that up. There you go. Okay. Could have went either way, and here it is. Hill, hill. Oh, well, yeah, she's on the nine. Don't jinx her. Don't jinx her. Greg will kill you. I'm going to give you a knuckle. Yes. I'm going to give you a knuckle sandwich. Where's I swear it? to God. No, she's not missing this ball. Nope. Hill, hill. Hill, hill. Good show. Good show. Hill Hill and Jen to break. John racks him up. <laughs> that answers my question from before. I said she was breaking so good from the one spot and then she changed but she reads the racks she's uh, she picked up that information and she knows where to place the cue ball depending on what is frozen what it, what isn't right rack mechanic stuff yeah. Th and they're good at it. they studied it forever and it's down to a science she's 
she took a lesson and paid for it on this, and uh, she said it was the best money she ever spent. What was that? She took a lesson on this rack, studying this rack stuff at, bra at breaking. I don't want to say, but uh, she said it was the best money she ever spent. And uh, I, I practiced with her last year for about an hour, last August, uh, before this thing started, and uh, it was right on the money. She was crushing it. I'm like, wow. I she has an open bridge on her break. Watch it. Very unusual. Well, you know what? She's going for placement, not power here. You it's know what? I was going to ask her, too, when I never did, but she used to use the perfecter, which is like a slide on the bird. I remember people using them. I thought but she, yeah, she, she didn't. She hasn't used it this tournament, so yeah. I was kind of surprised I was going to ask her about that. Maybe I'll ask her later. Yeah, watch. So she might have an open bridge right here, which is unusual. For, yeah, yeah. She, see that open bridge? Look at that. I could guess who she took a lesson from. I'm not, I'm not going to say any names, but I can take a guess. And eight ball in the side pocket. One ball's near the corner. And a five ball in the way. Yep. And the four is four eight combo. Five is dead in the way. Boy, you know what? Here's a tough push. Yep. Oh, boy, what a tough push this is. Um, well, actually, just put it up on the top rail. You're not banking the ball. That's all there is. Top rail, correct? Yep. Unless you can... Um, no, See, I was going to say send the two somewhere to, to tie it up, but uh, th that's not going to happen. There's nowhere to go with that. Yeah, Just send the cue to the top rail. And I guess that's all you can do. But she's going to get... Uh, Hit with a safety after that. You're not getting it back. Well, and that's and that's just it. it. It's tough to push here because. Yeah. You know, I wouldn't say this is the same situation, but I played a match earlier, and sometimes if you're hooked like this, sometimes you're better off going for a hit because you don't because your opponent can just lock you up anywhere, and then all of a sudden now you're in jail. But yeah, I see what you're saying. You know, if like that if she, the, if the one was hanging off the rail here, she could play. She no, could play the five one combo and and draw down, use the safety for the I, two. She's gonna kick this in. She's yeah. gonna try to kick this one yeah. ball in. Well, it's just what you just said. Right, because it, you don't want to leave. Have a, you don't have an option. She has the option to leave it on the top rail, but then she's gonna get hit right. with a, a, another safe coming back at her, which might be the best bet. Being on the hill, you don't want to kick this ball in, do you? I mean, I mean, these are diamonds and it's oh frozen. No. You know. Yeah, I mean it's it's tough. Yeah, I I would put it on the top rail at it, at that score with the score the way it is. Yeah. Yeah, she's. Because. Yeah, it, she is. Yeah, if you mess that up, you're dead. Good speed. Yep. I was gonna say run into the seven to guarantee you're gonna slow down. But Don't miss she it. has to figure that Lori John can put her in jail there. Lori John can play a safe here. She can thin the one, yeah. put the one ball near the middle diamond, send the cue ball down table. Which, now that I look at it, it really isn't that easy because it, it looks like the one ball is frozen. Yeah, yeah. If the one ball is frozen, it makes it a little bit more difficult. I'm thinking you're just going to load this up with some outside English and hit it soft. Right. And the cue ball's going to come right down. Well, yeah, that too. Yeah. <coughs> with any luck, look, it's stuck behind that, what is that, the 2 5 there? Yeah. In the way, at least. Yeah, and uh, kind of overhit that one. Yep. Wow. All right, didn't sell out. No combo on the 1-7. No, and the one ball doesn't play either. She's, no. looking at the, she's looking at the combo, though. Really? Oh, she, That's what she's uh, looking at, right. Well, well, then maybe she does have, have it. Excuse yeah, me. she left to hit the, the right side of this one ball and play the seven ball in the corner. Oh, now she's looking at the billiard this way. No, she's looking to see where she wants to hit the combo. 
She's looking to see where she wants the one ball to contact the seven yeah. to pocket the seven ball. I don't. This is a tough combo. I, I, I'm from from. Look, she can't play this combo. Oh, maybe from she. Here. I, don't know. I don't know. It doesn't look doable. Looks extreme. I mean, even if you were to play the combo, I mean, it's it's tough because your cue ball is going toward the pocket, and your one ball is going to come out. Well, your one ball comes out by the on the short rail, so does, I don't know. Does the one come off the long rail off the seven and go in the hole, or no? Or is it too far off? No. One, the seven ball is too far out. Okay. You can't do that. Well, she made up her mind about something. You can tell by her approach to the table here. Is she going to roll up on this? No. Well, that... Look at the nine ball. On the roof. Oh, yep. my God almighty. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, this is beautiful. So where's the weight, Pat? There's a Pat lot. Pat Fleming, where's the weight now? A lot of. You might want to loan that over to Lori, John. She might pay you money for it right here. A lot of uh, spectators watching this right now. Yeah. Lori John. Lori John's on yeah. the roof. On the roof. So with a safety, she could parallel this one down. She hits it, and oh, she's going to make it. She's going to make it. Yeah, she's trying to make that ball. And and it's a different ball game right now. Well, it, not a gimme it, yet. No, still nothing very easy. Yeah, <laughs> not a gimme. Probably an easy safety for, for Jen here. Well, that one ball might play past the seven. Yeah. Uh, she just half looked a at pocket, it. Half a pocket, and the cue ball's going over into the two, I think. She's close enough to play a good safety here, I think. Well, she could do that too, yeah. yeah. She, she's going to roll up on the seven ball, I think. Yeah, at Hill Hill, it's a little... Yeah, she's going to roll up on the seven ball. And... Well, no. didn't sell out anything, but... Got a chess match going to happen here. Yeah. You know, you might as well play the safety and swing at the nine here. Put the one on the Brunswick, uh, up on the top diamond with, with speed and just try and go into this nine right here. Did you like it? Yeah, you can you can do that too. I don't know. Oh. Uh, well, oh, 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 she wow. got her behind the five. Look, look at this. Wow, what wow. a great shot. What a great shot. Oh, boy. I don't think she has an edge of this. No, she definitely doesn't. She's kicking off the back yeah. rail. Yeah, and you know what? She's almost she's almost walking around with the demeanor like, wow, this could be it. This is a, uh, a loser-go-home match? It is, They yes. both have a loss, right? Yep. Oh, that's right, because Annie beat Lori John. Right. Well... She's supposed to hit this, though. She's got a good line on it right here. Needs, needs a rail, hit. needs Is a she... rail, needs a rail. Needs oh, a rail. No rail. Uh, no rail, no rail. Is she... Does she know she didn't hit a rail? Lori oh John has my. ball in hand. Lori John has ball in hand. I can't say anything. She snoozed it, and no one is saying a word. Oh Where's my. Lori John's husband here or somebody? Wow. Well, you know what? She has a good safety here. There was here. no rail, right? There was no rail. No rail. I didn't think so. She, she hit from behind it. She's wow. going to send the one down oh, no. now. Boy, she's going to kick herself later on if she loses the game over this. You know, you see three balls moving. You don't, you don't think to pay attention to it too much. Well, yeah, I think. This is a tough eight ball. Oh, is that the eight down no, here? No, the six ball. That's the six down the here. pocket, I believe, the one. It's not a... 
Yeah. Went out straight. Yep. Hit it straight. And, and it, but but Lori John snoozed the biggest play of, the, of this entire day. At Hill Hill, you don't want to snooze that that one, you know. Wow. Well, like Al said, it's it's getting late. You know, these players have been up since ten in the morning. Yeah, I'm just surprised well, that, that their first mattress since they probably got up around like nine. I'm surprised nobody on the floor over there yelled no rail, no rail, and nobody said anything. Uh, maybe they all snoozed it too. I don't know. Well, I mean, I'm certain of it though. I'm pretty certain myself, actually. Nice shot. Look at the oh, one nine. Look, look at the one this. nine. Look at the one nine. And she's gonna get the oh. win over this on a. Oh boy. I don't want to say anything to taint it, you know. And this ain't a gimme either, by the way. No, it's not. Cause that nine's off the rail a little bit. If you don't, uh, you might want to go rail first. Rail first on this, yeah. One ball almost full. Yeah. Rail first. Yeah, that's what she's looking at right yeah. here. But uh, uh, Lori John has to look at the tape on this. She's going to kick it, kick herself for it. There's no referee standing by to, for anything like that. So I'm not saying anything after it's over to her. She can. I don't know if you can hit this soft. No, I don't think she's going no, to. No, I don't think you can hit this soft. speed. That's there it did. is. There, yeah, she played the two-way duel. So. Yeah. Yes, sir. There it is, folks. What? Jennifer Breda takes the win. There you go. Wow. I don't know if yeah. you guys caught what happened there. The no hit, the no there was, rail. There was no rail. Yeah, right? yeah oh, we oh, both. I, I think both ladies slept on that. They, they snoozed it. it. They snoozed it. Because yep. Jennifer had the clear shot at the one prior in yep. the last rack, and she didn't see that. Yeah. They both are they, exhausted. They snoozed yeah. it. It was fun to watch. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right, thank in you so case, much. In any case, Lori John Jones, uh, I mean, Lori John Hansen is uh, eliminated out of a tournament. That was a B-side match, and Jennifer won it. Folks, we'll see you tomorrow. Thorsten yep. Holman. Thank Kyle you. Kyle Pippen. I want to thank Steve. Sutton, sudden death. Thank you, sir. And uh, the guy on the end is Ed thank Colhane. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Folks, that's all she wrote. I appreciate everybody's help. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow. There was a couple of mistakes in that rack, and I'm sure Lori John uh, I watch it later on. Uh, Pat Fleming and myself were sitting ringside here in the booth, and uh, we realized it was no hit. I guess you guys did, too. Good night, everybody, and uh, thank you for all your help. Like I said, uh, a little bit uh, tired right now, and I'm going to try to make uh, uh, 10 a.m. Uh, for Torsten Holman and uh, Kyle Pippen. All right, Eric, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Ryan McCreesh, Naldo, everybody out there, I got to try to get some sleep. Chris Freeman, I got a lot of equipment for sale. I upgraded. All right, I'll talk to you later, guys.